Okay, hey my little peach roonies. Hope you guys are feeling peachy today. We are gonna be heading into another episode of Life is Strange, episode four. Last episode was absolute emotional terrorism to the biggest degree ever. What I mean by that is my brain is now like, can't even handle what happened in the last episode. It is, uh, it was definitely a bit of a shock and I don't really know how this episode is gonna begin. You guys have just redeemed a hydrate, so I will hydrate. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, because um, I don't know whether the timeline we created in the last episode is also gonna be in this episode, but uh, we shall see, we shall see. So, just to remind you guys, this is a not so peachy, mature content warning stream. There is violence, gore, horror, languages, and adult themes. The adult themes of this particular um, like game can be kind of intense. We've seen suicide so far. Uh, so yeah, just, just to give you guys a little bit of a heads up. Also, Phoebe loves Claire, not to bother you, but could you upload Brianna from your challenge in my video tonight to the gallery? If you guys haven't uh, checked it out, I did upload on my main channel today. We did the grayscale, the black and white challenge. So if you haven't checked that out, please, 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 um, make sure that it's on your list of things to do and I will go ahead and upload them. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and pause our sad music in the background because we will be getting into some Life is Strange. Are you guys ready for this? Are you guys ready for this? Let me just catch up on these final few messages. Oh, I get what you mean now about these two not being in line. It's a little bit blurry, isn't it? Um, Tia loves Claire says, hi, hi, this is messages from Leah. Hi, Claire, I don't normally send bits messages because I thought a bit, I couldn't afford bits, but Tia was amazing enough to let me send a message for her, uh, for, for me. I don't know how to express how much I love you in one message. I've been struggling a lot this year, but you've always been the light in my darkness. Thank you for keeping me smiling through the hardest of times when I feel like there's nothing to live for. Um, oh, sorry, it scrolled by. When I feel like there's nothing to live for, for, I always remember you and your positivity. Thank you so, so much, Leah. Tia, thank you also for doing that for your friend. That's beautiful. And Eagle says, what color bandana for my little doggo? We get off tomorrow. Red, red looks really good if it's a black and white dog. It's just it's just a whole vibe. Simx93, thank you so, so much for subscribing. Batman Simmer, thank you for joining the Peach Squad with your Twitch Prime. And 1975 Cassidy, thank you so, so much for gifting a sub. Okay. Shall we get this on the go? Ep Summer is gonna head uh, back to work on Monday. This is probably gonna be my last stream for a while, to, uh, so she's gonna make sure that they enjoy it. Okay, I'm so sorry that uh, I'll try and find a good stream time, but don't forget if you ever miss them, you can check them out on uh, More Claire Siobhan. And let's go ahead and let's get the show on the road. I'm gonna move you guys here. I'm gonna switch this so that I can uh, see you guys as well. And, ooh. Are we okay? Have I just, what have I done? Oh, it's there, it's there, okay. Are you guys ready? Let's play some Life is Strange. Don't forget, no spoilers in the chat, please. No spoilers, you will be booted out the chat if you spoil. You can give me hints uh, in terms of what are good decisions to make, but don't say what the decision will lead to or like don't be too specific. And as a reminder on the really uh, spoilery bits, we'll switch to emo only in the chat. Okay, let's get this on the road. Let's play some Life is Strange. <laughs> Hopefully you guys can hear okay. Okay, so this episode is called Dark Room. I feel like it's gonna be kind of dark. I have definitely downloaded it. No. Okay, I'm gonna start my game again, but I downloaded it. I downloaded episode four on five, because I'm like, that is never gonna happen again. So let me just close. Don't worry, it's downloaded. It is downloaded. It is 100% downloaded. Don't even worry. I know it looks like it's not, but I downloaded four on five in advance today, so. We got them. We got them, don't worry. You guys are really excited in the chat. We can hear. I don't think there's much audio at the moment anyway, so yeah. Okay. I'm already starting to feel emotional! Did you guys remember what happened at the end of last episode? Do you guys remember? I've switched to this camera because it's a little bit smaller and I think there's a lot you guys want to see in this game, so I'm not using my big Fall Guys camera. So checking you better you better know it's there you better know that it's there do we get to hear the music on the stream i can't play the music because i get immediately copyright striked okay i'm really nervous i was like chloe Previously started to grow on, on life me. is strange i'll be quiet for this bit okay you don't know who the fuck i am or who you're messing around with don't ever touch me again freak Let's talk about your superpower. 
What are you doing here, Max? Stop! Don't come near me! Not now! It won't work! I know this isn't pleasant for any of us. Miss Caulfield, please, tell us everything. Hey, it's Thelma and Louise. That's Rachel's bracelet! Why the fuck are you wearing her bracelet? Calm yourself, all right? It was a gift. Max, we have to find Rachel soon. Like you said, it's time to start the search for clues. Welcome to my domain. Let's find what we want and beat it. Max, you better come check out these files. Rachel in the dark room. Over and over. That's it. Listen, I found pictures of Rachel and Frank. Being more than a friend. I can't believe she was banging Frank. Rachel straight up lied to my face. Why didn't she say anything? So who do you most want to blame? My fucking dad, of course. Hello? No, you don't. Do you know what it's like to wait for your father to come home when you're a kid? Ever since he died, my life has been dipped in shit. Chloe, I am awesome. We are awesome. <laughs> Hello, are you even listening, Maxine? This is totally fucked up. What else have I changed? Max Caulfield. Hold on. Chloe, you have a visitor. That end bit was so mud. Like, I, I immediately teared up. Immediately teared up. Okay. Are you guys ready? Are you guys ready? It was emotional, wasn't it? That bit at the end when you're riding on the bus and like, I thought Chloe, I thought Chloe would be dead. I thought like her and her dad's lives would have almost trade, traded places. But what actually we saw at the end was that she was um, paraplegic, is that the right word? She like, is, she was in like an assisted chair and she, I think she even, did she have like a feeding tube in her neck as well? Like, she was, she was, obviously had been in, in a car accident, is what I'm assuming. So yeah, it was intense, it was so intense. I was about to cry, but then my parents were around and they would be like, why are you crying, weirdo? Well, that was me! I get really emotional at, vi at video games. Quadra... Quadriplegic, quadriplegic, thank you, Yuck Smash, that's the correct term. Also, Marie9062, thank you so much for being here for two months. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Does this episode become more emotional or less emotional? The whales as well. Like, seeing whales, like, washed up is really sad, awful. I hate anything to do with, like, animals and, like, dead animals. I hate that, so... Yeah. Tough, tough. More and oh, you guys are saying more emotional. So much more emotional. Oh, <gasps> there's Chloe. And the whales. Jeez. The art style of this game is so cool. I like, like, I think if you don't go for ultra realism graphics, the game can age a lot better. It's weird so. hanging out with you again. I know. Oh. I'm glad we are, though. It was nice that you sent me actual letters. It's more than any of my other friends have done. So she did send a letter. And you even wrote on that cool parchment paper. It's so Max. So pretentious. But in I the last on it, like, timeline, she didn't get in touch with her at all while she was gone. You deserve the best stationery. Probably easier to write than to visit me. I don't mean that in a bitchy way. Not totally. You probably wanted to avoid awkward conversations like this. Uh, pretty much, yeah. Look, the worst thing you can do is treat me like a baby. I still want to laugh and talk shit with my best friend. Can we stop? This is seriously the best view of the sunset. What do photographers call that? The golden hour. See? Without you here, I'd have no clue. Bet you could take some amazing shots. Those beached whales are so sad. 
There's four beach whales. I kind of know how they feel. I only counted three last time. There's At five. Least I'm alive here with you. Why are the whales beached? What has like made that happen? You're a real survivor, Chloe. I know you have to deal with so much. I don't want anybody else feeling sorry for me. I Look at this that. amazing view, beach whales. <laughs> Along with my parents. My dad still feels guilty about buying me that car. Ah. Uh, talk about the accident or blame, I'm not gonna blame William. Are you okay to talk about the accident? We never actually have, huh? There's not much to say. Some prick in an SUV cut me off and I flew into a ditch. Jeez. Jeez. It's always everything. SUVs. I saw everything in bullet time. <gasps> I felt my back oh, snap. Oh, jeez. And that was the last thing I ever felt in my body. Oh, baby. When I woke up in the hospital, I literally couldn't move a muscle. Gosh, she's so Jesus. different in this timeline, isn't she? Like, I mean, in her personality. I, I don't know what to say. Don't say anything. I'm just happy I did get to see you again. I could have ended up vanishing out of the blue like that girl from Blackwell. The, oh, Rachel. So she never met Rachel? You mean Rachel Amber? When was the last time you talked to her? Uh, never. I just read about her in the news. I didn't even know her name. You did? This is such a different world than when we were kids, isn't it? After that snow and eclipse, it's more like the end of the world. Oh, so the snow and eclipse did happen in this timeline. Do you think so? I uh, haven't kept up with the details. I have more time on my hands than you. Plus, I'm a science nerd. What? But none of this makes sense. She's a. I know oh, she seem out of control. I don't want to talk over them. Sorry. As long as we're together, I don't feel afraid. Hanging out with you makes me feel like a total kid again. You don't even know. Listen, Chloe. I'm sorry I haven't been out to see you more. That was wrong. You're my best friend. Max. Thanks for coming out to see me. You're, you're doing awesome. I don't think so. Um, my, my nose is getting cold. Maybe we should get back to my place? It is hella cold out here. Hella? I hate that word, no offense. What? She taught us it in the other timeline. So in the other time, in this timeline, like, she's like a science nerd. And like, in the other timeline, she got kicked out of school. But in the other timeline, when we started talking about, like, the butterfly effect and chaos theory, Chloe, like, went ahead and, like, got loads of books and started researching it. So even in the other timeline, she, like, has the potential to, like, be really good at science as well, which is kind of, like, a cool sort of, like, crossover. It is, like, the same person, but, like, different parts of her are brought out in different timelines. And there's the lighthouse. The lighthouse that nobody can escape. So, yeah. Oh man, she's definitely like, she's like a lot sadder in this timeline, obviously. She's a lot calmer as well. She's just very different. Yeah, At the whole time I was like, it, it, her personality was kind of great. You know what I mean? I was finding her tough, but I would take that every time if it meant that she like, was in like a better place with her body and stuff, you know? Cause she's in, they've converted the living room into a That's hospital a room. tech layer. Feels like a high tech Because she needs all that stuff. But I am lucky my parents bust their ass to take care of me. Oh. I know it's hard for them. They're grateful you're here with them. Right. Especially when they can't even take a walk alone. Oh. Sometimes I have so like to always be there with her just, just in to give case. Them an excuse to yell at me. Pathetic, I know. Chloe, you're a great daughter. You're kind and sensitive. When you don't even have to be. Trust me, I still get my rage on. Especially when a nurse has to watch while I take a dump so she can wipe my bum. Jeez. Or when doctors flip me around like I was a science doll. I can't even imagine. But you're still amazing. You always have been since we were kids. Thanks again for coming, Max. I, uh, <clears throat> need to get my drink on. Uh, can you, can you bring me some water? Can we, can we do anything to change this timeline now? Or is like, is that it really? I'm gonna like investigate everything. There's the old Chloe. 
So she still look. She still does have a little bit of that like side of her, and she's got like a special. Oh, Chloe can totally control her computer. Oh, she can compete. She's got like a special so tool to People use her, her computer, help. which is really cool. Chloe is still a punk at heart, but she. That's so cool that Chloe has made friends online. Oh, I don't feel like right like reading her messages and stuff, but she's still the same girl. I should offer to put makeup on for Chloe. Not that I can, but it would be fun. Man, Joyce and William built a whole new bathroom for Chloe. Wow. They're so great. It's nice my parents sent a card at least. Oh, her parent. Honestly, Max's parents are so sweet. Like, so freaking sweet. Petite Spooks, thank you so, so much for subscribing. Welcome I to you, the Peach who this Squad. Is. Kind of a generic card. So sorry for what happened, now that I'm here for you. Megan. I wasn't very available to Chloe. Real nice. Sorry, I'm not reading it out loud, am I? Just thought I'd drop you a quick note to let you know that I'm thinking about you. I feel so lame writing stuff like, I hope you are well. I know your life is so different and I don't want that to get in the way of our friendship. Yes, I haven't been around lately, but that will change soon. I hope you are well. At least I sent road trip selfies to Chloe. <laughs> I'm sure that made her feel great. Oh, that's great. a cute little picture, though. It's tough, though. It's hard when you're younger and your friend goes through something like that. I still can't believe you're I put You're Chloe almost in too chair. young to know how to deal with it. Like... Max, it is so cool that you're here again. Oh. I'm glad you think so. Like, yeah, it's obviously, it's, it's the hardest for Chloe Snow by a country mile. Over. But it's hard to know the right way to, to deal with it when you've not had the experience of ever, like, having to deal with something like that before, you know? Oh, the snow the dough. The dough. I guess not the everything The dough follows changed. us around, doesn't it? Hydrate, thank you. <laughs> Even have adults have a tough time dealing with things like this sometimes. They do. It's like Hello, different Chloe. people are better at different stuff, <laughs> She likes stuff, fluffy aren't they? animals now. And she likes, she, you were wearing that little, um, that little hot dog on your top when you sent the picture to her. That's a serious heat lamp. A, a heat lamp? Huh. And a window. What's the Does heat Chloe lamp for? Does anyone know that? Think about her childhood. Is it to make sure she gets a she vitamin D? She can't even feel the grass now. Oh. At least Chloe doesn't weigh that much. And she's got a medical ventilator. Oh man. She has to use that ventilator just to breathe. Jeez. Look at the drawing on the fireplace. Is that in another room? I don't think it's in here. I need to give her a water, don't I? Let me go grab her some water. Instead of handing Chloe a bong, I'm feeding her water. Did Can I we get... change this timeline? Can I do anything about Drink this now? Or am I just like locked into this timeline? But then I also don't want her dad to oh, die. Man. No wonder my throat is dry. I don't think I've talked this much the whole year. Oh. Have you ever thought about doing a podcast or something? I wish That's I could a cool idea. your face right now. A I think that's a cool idea. Dude, I am a pod in a cast. Boring. Ouch. It was just a thought. I know you're just trying to help. <sighs> yeah, that's become a bad habit of mine. You sound like an adult now. It seems like we were kids in another life. Can I not tell her? She believed me in the other timeline, so can I not explain things to her? What do you remember about us as kids? We all have different memories. I think about us as little pirates. Yeah, I will check about my drawer. I will do. Me too. But we're still pirates in our own way. <laughs> yeah, right. Check me out, Chloe of the Caribbean. No way will I get on a fucking boat now. Unless you're with me. As you can see, I can't keep all my other friends away. You have me. You have me. I'm not leaving you, Chloe. This is such a well, sad note to start on, isn't it? I mean, I loved your cards and photos, but... I know I wasn't around much. No excuses. I'm a loser. But I am trying to make things right. How? Dude, you're not super max. And I'm not trying to guilt trip you. That's I don't want dad to die for. either. But I do miss blue-haired Chloe. Are you lonely? Are they okay? I'm gonna ask about her parents. Are they okay? I mean, are they still happy together and everything? So now you're Dr. Bill? 
I guess they're good, considering they have to deal with me. They laugh and hold hands. And I hope they still get busy, too. I <laughs> think Joyce and William are incredible. Her daughter's really Max, sweet. The accident has been so hard on them. Our insurance sucks, and the medical bills you are, are fucking insane. You guys insane. say I might have to choose between the worlds. Can they pay? Can they pay all the bills? <sighs> no way. They keep the numbers away from me, but it doesn't take much research to find out I'm costing my parents almost a million dollars a year. <gasps> Jeez. Chloe, you're priceless. Uh, <laughs> no pun intended. How, how would you afford you that? You are such a geek. How would you afford that? That's why I love you. If you're in America, how would you I afford stuff like this? Because in the UK, like, that, See, I'm practically you would just a human entertainment system. You get help with this. How it does it work in America? To chill out together and watch a movie like when you'd spend the night at my house. <laughs> What do you want to watch? Uh, I think I'm in like a, a mellow Blade Runner mood. I always cry at the end. Plus, you know, I always wanted to have cool colored bangs like Pris. I know. You would look incredible with blue hair. Oh. Now let's get this show on the road. And you better not fall asleep on me like you always do when we watch movies. I remember, Max. I swear I won't fall asleep. Not when you're here. Not yet. Oh, bless her. She's so, like, she's, she's lost her, like, that spark her completely, hasn't machine. she? No more bongs for her. Thanks. Oh. I uh, think you missed a grain stuck in my eyeball. <laughs> Hard to believe how just a little sand can cause such a big mess. It's like that Chinese proverb, a spark can start a I fire imagine that not being able to scratch your eye or like your, I get fluff thing. in my eyes all the time and so not I've being heard. able to just like alleviate that. Jeez, you'd have to like learn to like mentally deal with that in such a huge way. She has to use a lot of lotion to keep her blood circulating. What? Jeez, this is like very educational. Med medical supplies. I feel bad because like I'm searching her room and like... Like, she's she just watching me search the room. You're... Oh, she was saying something to me then. Am I getting Blade Runner? Uh, here's the DVD. I don't think I can go to, like, the rest of the house. Oh, my God. I made that mix for her when we were 12. Oh, pirate power. I stub my toe and I lose my spark. Literally, if I don't get eight hours sleep in a night, I lose my spark. <laughs> wow, sir. Chloe was a straight A student. Wow. She could have gone to any college. This is that's really bastard. different. I am so glad Chloe stole your bullshit fund. Even if it wasn't another reality. So Blackwell prides itself on making sure students with disabilities receive a full comp uh, compliance. However, given that the campus buildings have all been constructed pre-1977, our school has not yet undergone the, mo the modernization. So... so that she can't attend Blackwell, but that day will come. What? So she can't, they won't make the school wheelchair friendly for her. Jeez. So she can't even go to Blackwell Academy in this timeline because the school won't do the things that it needs to do to make it so that she can go, which is super messed wow, up. Sir. Chloe was a straight A student. Despite everything, Aww. They're still a happy family. It's cool that in this reality, Chloe really loves skating too. But she can't skate now. Oh. Okay, there was one last thing over here to look at new. Have I looked at everything? I think I've looked at everything, haven't I? I want to make sure I don't miss anything like before. So, okay, we'll put the DVD in. You're really my only friend who kept in touch. Oh, everything. Like, I feel like it's like quite like a low energy stream but it's because it's such a sad subject matter like jeez i did not know it was gonna take this turn i had no idea that the game did this turn at all Aww. pies absolute pies little cuties Oh, 
I really want to get her back. I want her back so much. You guys are saying it will get lighter hearted. Okay. I really hope so. Oh, she slept with her little baby. I cannot believe you fell asleep so fast. How dare you? I know you were beat down after the day with me, and Blade Runner is a pretty dreamy movie to watch at night. Uh, we still have sleepovers. Replicant? Sorry, I can see you're not wide awake like me. No, I'm sorry I crashed so hard. Were you okay? I do have a mother and father when you're not falling asleep on me. You are a bitch in the morning. It's <laughs> the company I keep. I want her to tell her. I want her to tell her about Yesterday was everything. Such a blast. Unlike give Chloe the great. choice almost. Seeing you. I know things were different when we were just dorky kids, but being with you made me feel like when we were a little bit. I, I don't I don't want spoilers. I don't I don't wanna I don't wanna do spoilers, but it meant a lot to me just Oh to you guys are switched to emo only. And, and okay. Bullshit. That must mean the spoilers Fuck. coming. Um I'm getting my regular head pains. Uh can you pretty please go upstairs and get my my morphine injector in the bathroom? Morphine injector? It's uh, it's total Star Trek shit. You can't even see the needle. Seriously, I, I need it. Um, uh. My parents keep this wag upstairs because they think I can't get to it. But you can, Max. Like a pirate, right? I'm on it, Chloe. So we're off to go get her like her morphine injection. Which means we should be able to go ahead and go into the living room and see if the little bit that we scratched into the fireplace is still there. That is actually like the first thing I'm gonna go ahead and check. Oh, that Bills, he's trying to work out how to pay for everything. Yep. It's still there. It's the same graffiti from before. And then we've got a message from Victoria. Come by around room tonight. Max will be cool. Just wanted to make sure since you walked away so fast. Nathan was worried too. Do you want to talk? Hit me up, Kay. Love you. Max, if you're mad, just tell me, Kay. Silence. If you want to take when door is open, love you. In this reality, Victoria sucks up to us. Like, what? What, 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 what? I call you like I have to go. Hey, honey, don't forget to walk the plant. Okay, that's all still the same. Taylor. Um... You didn't see me, it's okay to cry. Is this, is this still from the last timeline? I don't understand. Nathan? Peace out. What? In a dark room, develop, in a dark room, developing shots of the contest. Sweet. So no two worlds for you. Nathan's our friend in this timeline. Like what? Peace out. Okay. Where's... Where is... Is it Warren? Where's Warren? Alyssa? Hey Max, it's a shame you hung out with those people. I thought you were different. Alyssa, I saw you throw a toilet paper at me. Oh my gosh, I was not aiming it at you, I swear. Don't do it again. So in the last timeline, we kept stopping things hitting her. In this timeline, she's doing it to us. What? Uh, cool, I've got a bullet at home, but we'll get together soon. Don't tease me, it's been too long. That was the 8th of the 11th. Wait, 11th of August, is that? Because we're in America? And now... Was that like a whole year ago? I don't know. I can't really tell. I think it was a while ago, at least. I think he's struggling with, like, the bills. These whales are just a preview of the tornado to come. <gasps> and the Prescott Foundation? Do you think Rachel the whales Amber would- is even missing in this reality. Wow. I guess I can't change everything. Do you think that the whales would have come up on, <sighs> on the shore even in our old reality? Because I think they would have done. They might get their own home taken away because <gasps> of medical bills. Oh my gosh. That's They're overrun on their bills. They need 12 grand in 15 days. Wow. Well, that sounds impossible. Hey, William. Um, am I bothering you? Why, yes, Max. I love going through bills. <laughs> Kidding. How can you bother me? I haven't seen you in forever. I know. You look exactly the same. <laughs> it's so cool. Good. Or I'd be scared if I didn't look like me. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
Of course, you seem more adult now. So I dress different mind? in this reality too. Um, I don't know how to say this, but I'm truly sorry about what happened to Chloe. Me too. All it takes is a few minutes to change a girl's whole life. But she's alive. She's been a trooper. Mm. Is she mad at me for not staying in touch? She should be. I have no excuse. She was disappointed. But she knows you care. And I know how hard it is to process all this. It's taken us years. William? I just want you to know that whatever happens, I'll always be here for Chloe. Always. I know you will, Max. I was impressed by Chloe's room and all the high-tech equipment. You should be. We could buy a few mansions for what it all costs. Uh, the insurance helps, but I, I don't know, Max. I know it must be hard on you guys. How do you deal? I don't understand how you're meant to, be able to deal like with this. That money was. We have to mortgage our home, and that's pretty scary. But, but we'll get through it. Price is always right. Get it? No. Let's ask about Joyce as well. Being around you and Joyce again is so. Nostalgic. Very old school, as they say. <laughs> I think it's great for Chloe to see you. Makes Joyce happy, too. So, it's not all bad news in Arcadia Bay. Or is it? Crazy weather, Rachel. I'm gonna ask about... Maybe, because he's one of the only people we've not been able to ask about the Prescott family, because obviously he doesn't exist in the other timeline. So I'm gonna ask him. The Prescott family might be bad news. What do you think about them? Evil. Next question. Sounds like you know them well. More than I want to. But Joyce has to work for those greedy bastards at Pan Estates. Oh, what? She's got a different job. I don't job. Like to think about it. Okay, Rachel Amber. I was reading about that missing girl. Rachel Amber? Oh, yes. Yeah, she went to Blackwell, right? Oh, poor thing. That's a real nightmare for a family. I get scared thinking about Chloe and that we might lose her someday. What do you think is going on with all of this crazy weather and animals dying? Nobody knows, right? It is Nostradamus type shit, pardon my French. But all I actually care about now is Chloe and Joyce. My family. I have to go see if Chloe needs anything. It was so great talking with you again. <laughs> you act like it's the last time. And please, keep me from these bills whenever you want. Her dad is so Bill sweet. Should all just say, dear sir, you are sweet. Her dad is like super, super sweet. Joyce is a food coupon boss. Uh, and Joyce doesn't work at the diner in this timeline. No change to spare anymore. Now it's back to cookies. Ah, uh, so that was like the saving jar, but obviously they've used up all the savings, so it's become a cookie jar again. I'll make sure I'm not missing anything in this room. That's the window that we threw the keys out of. Oh, we go to the garden. Wait, what was that? To think that our destiny oh, is that's the to keys. keys. Miranda Chavez, thank you so, so much for the bits. Eagle Gracie says, my eyes are full of tears. I love how Max is so sweet and helpful. Honestly, I think Max is really sweet as well. The, the house, house is fully so painted great. as well. That's the first thing I noticed. We finally had the time to paint the house and fix up the garden. So they got their house. Like Everything was going so much better until, obviously, Paul or Look dead birds as well. Birds. It's happening in this timeline. It's happening here too. Until uh, poor little Chloe's life was changed forever. And butterflies, a grave. Oh, that's for the putty cat, right? I'm sorry, Bongo Kitty. But you passed on before I changed this reality. On a heavy heart, DD. Thank you so, so much for gifting a sub. Welcome to the squad, new Peachy. Sorry, that was 20 minutes ago. Uh, I, I missed that because we were catching up on so much stuff on Chloe here. Chloe actually moved our drawing so she could see it from her room. Oh. Chloe. That's so sweet. Oh man. The swing is the gone. The swing is gone now. It must have been sad for Chloe when Chloe took here? it down. Yeah. I'm glad Chloe gets a room with a view. Chloe's probably like, why are you in the garden? I asked you to get me my morphine ages ago. Okay, she's right though. Let's head upstairs. We don't have yeah. that creepy garage with all the recording equipment anymore, do we? Joyce and William never had a garage sale before. So they're trying to make money. And then more bills. 
They're drowning in debt. Jeez. Just to take care of their daughter. Such oh. bullshit. This is so sad. It's not fair that like something that traumatic happens to a family and then they already have to, thank you for the posh to check. Uh, they already like are dealing with so much and then they have to think about money. Like one of the most like stupid, stressful things you can think about anyway. It's all about you, But like Arcady the thing Bay, that you end up worrying so much it? about. I'm a terrible money worrier. I get so much anxiety around money. Oh, this is her old bedroom. Oh no, this is Joyce's room. Oh, Max, it is so nice to have you around. It's Joyce. Hi, Joyce. Good morning, Max. Ah, oh, you and Chloe are so much quieter now than when you were kids. I remember. It's nice waking up in your house again. Oh, William and I love it. Finally seeing you and Chloe together after all these years. After the accident. The parents love her, don't they? I wish I was a better friend. I know Chloe doesn't get many visitors. Oh, Max, you're Chloe's best friend for a reason. You're here exactly when she needs you. Who helps Chloe out when you guys are at work? We have a series of revolving nurses and caretakers. <laughs> Chloe still causes trouble even if she can't move. Max, Chloe's condition is not improving. Her respiratory system is very weak, and she, she, do you know what I'm saying? <sighs> Choice. What, she doesn't have much I'm time so left? I'm so sorry you have to Is go that what she's trying this. to tell me? Bad or good, I embrace every moment with you my daughter see. and my husband. Yeah, Papa. This is what it means to be a family, and we'll always be one, no matter what. Aww. How are you doing, Joyce? I'm doing the best I can, Max. I won't lie, it's difficult. But nobody said life was easy here in Arcadia Bay. Zeria Joy, thank you so much for being here for two months. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Eco Hub, David Marsden. She won't even know him though, surely. Do you know somebody named David Madsen? He um, might hang out at the two wheels. Well, that was random. Yeah, he's a, a bus driver. He comes in sometimes. Cute, quiet. Why? He's her type, isn't oh, he? Oh, um, I, I was just curious. You always were. Nice to see that everything doesn't change. Plus, you guys have to work, too. Ah, oh, Bill and I have no time for ourselves. And we're working more than we're living. Aww. I even had to take a part-time gig at Pan Estates. Ugh. Do Is you that... know the Prescotts? Oh, yeah, we I need to find out Sean about these. Sean Prescott won't be happy until he owns everything in Arcadia Bay. Stay away from his son, Nathan. Well, they're friends in this timeline. They're so, texting each other. What do you think is going on here with all of this eco-havoc? Maybe Arcadia Bay just wants to be left alone. I know the feeling. Honestly, I don't give a shit about too much outside our house. I don't blame you, Joyce. Except... Now we have dead birds and beach whales outside our front door. So maybe I should care, for Chloe's sake. I have to tell you how much I love seeing you and William together again. He's been such a hero through all this. Chloe and I are lucky to have him. William is still the same. Uh, let's ask about Chloe and William. Chloe and William seem like they still get along so good. Yeah, those two are closer now more than ever. Chloe will actually listen to William while she usually ignores me. Oh, it's so cute when they gang up on poor old me. You rule, Joyce. Shit. Things would be different if I did. I like how you think, kid. I better get back to Chloe now. It's good talking with you, Joyce. You too, honey. Oh, the parents are so nice. Imagine going around to your friend's house and your parents were as nice as that. It would oh, be amazing. No. <gasps> Showing signs I of rapid weakening. How bad Chloe's injury really was. This accounts for a recent anemia and loss of breath. As a doctor, I'm, I commit to well-being, but I want you to understand the reality: the respiratory failure is common in people with severe spinal injuries. Your daughter is one of the bravest, strongest parents uh, patients I've ever had, and I'm proud to be working with her. I just want you, as parents, to prepare for any and all possibility. I believe Chloe should also be made aware of her changing condition. If you would like to discuss this further, you have my contact information. So she, it's the end of the road. It's the end of the road for her. Her, her respiratory system can't, can't handle it anymore. And I'm just gonna make sure I've not missed anything. Ooh. 
Let's check all this out. It, it looks like such a sweet shot of Chloe. It looks like Chloe might picture. die soon, basically. Imagine just doing doing this. So like Joyce would be like, He's "Why are you awesome. in my husband's drawer? You might find something you don't want to find in in the side Look of a man's drawer, you know." They have no idea what's in their future. Oh, is that is that those two? Is that Joyce and William? What? I know we've seen that picture before, but now I've seen William. He looks so different, you know? You guys in the chat are just all like sad cry faces. It is a moche, isn't it? I, wa I want to see Chloe's room. Wasn't it like here? Or was it this one? Is this Chloe's? Wow. Has it still got the bit on the wall where we grew? And we recorded like all the bits that we grew? Because we did that, yeah, it's still got this, but she hasn't scribbled over it here. She scribbled over it when Chloe left her. Uh, when Max left her. But at least we never had to hide from step douche. A blue butterfly? Oh. I'm sure this is a total coincidence. Butterflies are like such a thing in this, aren't they? The fact that butterflies like fly around the cat's grave makes me think they're like associated with like death or something. I never heard much about William's brother. Sorry for not keeping in touch with the accident. Work has been piling up. Been sent to Salt Lake City. I wish I could have sent you a bigger check, but you know the story and money is nobody's favorite thing. Maybe I'll see you next spring for a visit. So they're losing touch with their family as well because no one can handle it. I bet this is Jeez. a really common story. Chloe always did love stomping around in her toys. I kind of want to open this and see what's in here. Another letter. Too bad Joyce and William can't get any help from the Prescott Foundation. Thank you for helping me update in Chloe's condition. I can imagine the struggle you're going through. I'm so sorry that I can't help you with a loan at this time. Like anyone else, everyone else I'm under what with my own medical bills. Please, can you give Chloe a hug? So the Prescotts won't help them out either, despite the fact that she's they working for They bought crutches for Chloe. Hoping she might walk again. That look, they look super clean, like they've never been used. Oh, bless them. Poor things. Oh, it's such a sad timeline, guys. It's such a sad timeline. Jeez. I'm, I'm glad I've got Darcy here to give little reality. strokes to. This is so sad. I feel so guilty for putting Chloe and her family through this. Jeez. You didn't I put them give through Chloe this. I could the choice of keeping William alive, but that would be cruel. Is there no way back? I see that they're a family again. And who am I to judge? Which is the better reality? But she's not going to be alive for much longer, is she? Azuria Joy 7, thank you so, so much for gifting. Th th thank you, first of all, for resubscribing for two months. Thank you so much for using your bits. And then thank you also for gifting five of you guys in the chat with Peachy subscription. If you're in the chat, please, can we send some love? Uh, so put some hearts in the chat for Azuria Joy. Oh, it makes me so, so sad that they were, like, getting her crutches thinking, you know, let's not think it's the worst case scenario. Things might be okay. Can I, why can't I turn the light switch on? Is it here? There we go. Is her little pi, oh, look. The pirate's hull isn't there anymore. Nothing here. I mean, there's definitely some meds in there. It's cool that Chloe uses natural medicine, too. Can we search in here? The bathroom looks almost the same. Just more medicine. And then... We don't get any options How's to take pictures yet. Funny. I think I look older. There's no... Where are we supposed to go? What, wasn't the medicine supposed to be in here? Oh, there's two cabinets. There we here go. It is. I never thought I'd be delivering morphine to my best friend. Thank you for putting hearts in the chat to say thank you, guys. I'll switch the light off. The 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 whales might be getting washed up ashore, but we should try and save the polar bears, you know? Should I just make sure there's nothing else to check? I think I've seen everything, though. Apparently, the only thing that hasn't changed is this view. I'd have thought the butterfly effect would have had more stuff that it would have changed, but I don't think it has. We can't go in these rooms. Okay, let's head back to Chloe. 
Oh, Katrina also. Katrina1990, thank you also for gifting a sub with a uh, subscription as well. Welcome to the squad, new Peacheroo. Do we miss anything here? The games console isn't out anymore. That's the one thing I've they noticed. They gave Chloe their giant expensive HD TV. And they oh. use her shitty tube television. I guess because she, there's nothing else for her to do. She just has to sit and watch TV all day. Bonjour. That's great they finally went to Paris. Oh, they were always talking about it. Oh, I can talk to somebody about that. I wonder if it's Chloe or Damn. one of the parents. This is just for Chloe's basic supplies. Wow. So is that a monthly payment? 8,500. Oh, wonderful. I'm just going to see if Hello I can speak again, to him about... Um, nice to see you back. Paris? Yeah. So you finally made it to Paris. Oui, as they say. <laughs> Not me, because I can't speak French. But it was a great experience. Especially for Chloe. I can see her loving it there. You guys rock for going on a family adventure like that. She talked about going to school there. But that's oh. not practical anymore. Imagine her going to school in Paris. That's not fair, Max. It's I have to fair. go see if Chloe needs anything. <laughs> okay, let's go give her a morphine shot. Jeez. This is heavy stuff, right? How are you guys handling it in the chart? If you guys are handling it okay in the chat, please send the Salma emoji. I think there's a Salma emoji. Fine. Yeah, please send Salma. Uh, give me the blue pill. I'm sorry. I'm nosy, but not precise. Go ahead and plug it right in. It's so easy <laughs> and painless. Um, okay, so we put it into okay, our IV. Get ready to yell for your folks if I screw up. Oh, oh trust me. I, I can see a mixture in the chat of Salma's handling it and Sad Faces not handling it. It's tough. It's really heavy stuff. This of is course, really heavy my pain stuff. Just keeps getting worse. But you caught me on a good day. You probably made a day good. Max, I'm so grateful that I'm even able to hang out with you. See, I'm getting mushy. I, I, I I'm already high. I want to hug her, but I don't know if like You're I can't so even bad. hug her. Do you want anything else? Um. Stop me if I'm being too emo, but can you grab one of the photo albums over there? I'm trying to get Darcy's knots out while he's here. We he's kids. got like knots you have to keep Please. like getting rid My of. My is like emo shedding. ground zero. Plus Max Caulfield does not pass up a photo Okay, album photo album albums. Price. Not gonna lie, yeah. I love a good opportunity for a little bit of a photo album flick through. So I am more than happy to look through some photo albums. Although I didn't actually listen where she said they were, so we're just gonna have to try and see if what we can find. Oh my god. Oh, I, I think they were on that side we maybe? 12. Over here? Wait, was there not a draw set that oh it's over here? Photo album is on top! Everything. I found it, I found it, I found We're it, I found still it. Happy family again. Okay. I love going through photo albums. Whenever I go to Ali's parents' house, his mum likes to always whip one out. And there's so many hilarious pictures in there, but she never lets me take a picture of it on my phone to share you with you guys. Like bath pictures okay? when they're little. Perfect. Oh my god. Look how little we are there. We look like toys. I remember that day by the lighthouse. The my lighthouse. dad was pissed at us. He actually tried to give us a time out. And you laughed at him. <laughs> my dad would have banished me. Banished. Oh, can we not look at more pictures? Yes, turn page. Sorry, Darcy, Baba, but I need to get your knots beautiful. Oh, awesome picture. We look so badass in our pirate gear. I love that they were into pirates. That's so freaking cool. Had the chance. Especially because they live There's by the still sea. Time for you. Oh, it's turned into a sad time with the photo album. It was meant to be a nice, happy time. Oh man, there we are making pancakes. I never got that picture, I did I? I think if I'd have got the picture, it would have been in my here. Dad took that picture only five years ago. But I didn't get it because I was like I was yesterday. panicking about the dad dying. I wish it was. Me too. I think we'd have seen it in this album, which this would have been photo. really cool. Maybe I could. Can you use it to go back? That's the photo. That's the photo that we used. Listen, Max. My respiratory system is failing, and uh, and it's only getting worse. I've heard the doctors talking about it when they thought I was zonked out. So she already knows. So I know I'm just putting off the inevitable while my parents suffer along. And I will too. This isn't how I want things to end. What? 
What are you saying? Oh no. I'm saying that being with you again. No, has she's not going to ask us so to do something. Is she? I just wanted to feel like when we were kids running around Arcadia Bay and everything was possible. She's crying. Max is crying. And you made me feel that way today. I want this time with you. Don't ask us to do this. To be my last memory. Do you understand? Yes, I do. All you have to do is crank up the IV to eleven. Honestly, I thought she was going to ask us to go to... Can I rewind time if I do this? Can I rewind time? On the one hand, I am a really big believer in the idea that you should get to choose your own fate. Like, if you should be able to choose the to not live in pain just to, like, keep a status quo or make other people happy. Can I... I'm just going to do a poll to check with you guys if I can, if I can rewind if I do this. Like, can I rewind? Because, like, honestly, if this was real life, I would 100%- I, I, I can't say that I would be able to do this. I don't think I would. But I support the idea that she deserves this choice. This is her life and she should get to decide how she leaves this world and it should be on her own terms. However, like, I don't want to do that and then the game just ends and I've just killed Chloe. Like... I don't want that to be the case either. You guys are saying that I can rewind. Should I give it a go? Her parents are gonna hate me. Her parents are gonna absolutely hate me. I don't know if you can come back from that with them ever. You won't be, you won't be able to go to the funeral. You won't be able, like they'd never accept you in the house again. They never wanna see you again. You probably get criminal charges because we're 18. We'll probably go to prison. Like this is the reality of this. I'm gonna try and- I'm gonna see what happens if I accept. Chloe, I'll just drift asleep. Dreaming of us here together. Forever. What? This is so rough. This is so much, guys. Abby Berry, thank you so much for subscribing for two months. Emotional times to be subscribing, emotional times. They're gonna know that she died this way. Like, they'll do an autopsy and they'll know that she died of an, a morphine overdose. I mean, of the ways to go, morphine overdose, I'm assuming, is that you'll just, like, Thank fall asleep. Thank you so much. I'm so proud of you for following your dreams. Don't forget about me. Never. I love you, Max. See you around. Sooner than you think. Oh my god. What is this game? It's too much. Can I rewind? I can't rewind. It won't let me rewind. Oh my gosh. I'm sorry, William. <gasps> is this me making a decision to do to go back? Oh my gosh, no. But it, uh, what is the right thing to do here? I guess I have to continue. I have to like get him back in focus. This bit's really hard by the way, or maybe I'm just really bad at it. But this took me ages last time. See what I mean? I'm so bad at this. <laughs> I'm so bad at this. I just can't make them go in focus at all. Like that's in focus, surely. There. Why does this particular photo have such magical powers? I don't understand. Someday dad will get one of them newfangled computers. I hope the back flash in this didn't moment. scare you, Max. This is a keeper. That photo, for whatever reason. Oh my gosh. Hello? 
Can't we just hey, tell honey. him to drive more slowly? What? Look, is it, 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 oh my gosh. Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. He of has to die for her not to have that happen to her. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? I'm beginning to think you guys wanted to me to play this game you just to see me cry. Me Your wish will no definitely happen. Dad. Don't blow it because tonight your She's made it so there's no way to go back. Salmon surprise with chocolate cake for dessert. Max, you'll be here too, right? She's never leaving me. That makes all of us. Oh no. I hope she tells like future Chloe what happened. Although I think Chloe will be mad at her. Max, you are being so fucking strange. Like you're never gonna see us again. Chloe, I'm so sorry. I tried to make things different for you. I, I did try. I'm sorry. I don't know exactly what you're talking about, but come on. You have made things different, like my whole life. You're my best friend. I've got you and a great family. What's to be sorry for? We'll be best friends forever. And when we grow up, we're taking over the world. Listen, whatever happens, I want you to be strong. Even if you feel like I wasn't there for you. Because I will never abandon you, Chloe. I'll always oh have Oh my your gosh, back. is anyone else in the chat crying? Always. If you guys are also feeling very emotional having a little cry session in chat, please put in a Babel. Use Babel to show that you're crying. Ugh. So that does happen. He, she does lose her dad. And that reality is gone. And, we're, and it's back to this reality. She never goes to France. And she marries him instead. And she never gets a car for her 18th birthday. Instead, she's arguing with him. Darcy's licking the plate. Good job of finishing my food. <laughs> Lots of Abel's in the chart. Lucy or Sim says this is so emotional. Chloe Marie says that photo is the key between the timelines. That's why it's so important. That's why she had to burn it. So this timeline is all back now. Oh my gosh. That timeline's gone. And they've brought this inside. Wait, wasn't this still outside in the last timeline though? Or are they, they now using this? Okay, they're using this to try and figure everything out. She has to tell Chloe, surely. She's got to tell her. And at least it explains some stuff for Chloe then a little bit. Maybe it'll help her with accepting things a little bit better, but I don't know if it will. Because then she'll feel like she's like a choice Chloe, between the two. You're alive, yes. Whoa, whoa, down, Max. You get one kiss and now you're all over me? I'm just, I'm just, I'm so glad you're here. You sound high, but thanks for the morning grope. Since we were up all night playing CSI Arcadia Bay, I was still spaced out here trying to put all this info together. Max, did you forget we've gone over this? Can, can we, we tell her? Do we get the sleeping. chance to tell her? I don't know if it's too Not heavy, anymore. though. I don't I'm know just if it's too much. Spaced out too. Do you want to go out the window, Darcy? Welcome back to the real world, Max. I'm just going to let open the window for Darcy. There you go, Baba. I don't think I can ever tell Chloe about oh, what happened. Oh, she's not going to tell her. She's not going to tell Let's her. Let's look at the big board and see all our pieces in the puzzle so far. Then click them on. One day your life will flash before your eyes. I mean, yeah, that definitely just happened. And now... That snow dough always makes me think of William and Chloe. That's what we saw in the other reality, but she had a whole bunch of them. Oh, man. So you can't keep that reality. You didn't get a choice. I guess the choice would be whether you helped Chloe end her life or not. And I'm interested to see, when we finish this, it tells you like how many people picked those choices. I'm interested to see how many people picked that they would have helped Chloe end her life. I'm interested to see what you guys did, but I won't pull it because like, no, I, I could pull it while, we're, while, while I'm doing so this bit, close, couldn't I? Yet so close, oh yet so far away. so windy. We have to do three main things. Right. Um, what things? One, decipher Frank's logbook. 
to get Nathan's phone to find out where he's been during the Vortex Club parties with Kate and Rachel. And see whatever hidden shit he's got in his messages. Three beats step Dan until he tells us about Frank, Nathan, and the darkroom. Too bad I don't have a gun anymore. Yes, that's the solution. We'll have to do this on our own. Dude, at least let me kick his ass, then rewind. There you go. Fine, you guys can let me know. Power. Which I can't waste on shit like that. Or Blackwell would be in big trouble. At least you let me take that money to pay Frank off. <sighs> Don't remind me. I just want him off your back. Our back. I know. At least I feel less bad we about get busy in the garage now, to see what they didn't help her, did they? I'm gonna cyberstalk some names and see where that leads. Or to who. And be careful of Stepcrack. Unless you want to hang out with him after you stood up for his ass yesterday. Oh, please. Oh, I want to go like hug her again. Like, I she's real, she's this. here. I guess this is like the equivalent for Max, isn't it? Just like taking a picture. I just want to like touch her shoulder. I want to tell her, don't smoke, it's bad for you. And you need to, you yes, need to. Chloe Price was here. You can't smoke because your dad has basically had to give up his life for you, so you can't make your life shorter by smoking. How okay? Much you have to live. Her. You have to live. Even Holmes and Watson didn't use every piece of information. I just want her now to like make the most of her life. Staying up all night is the best excuse to drink lots of coffee. We hate smoking gun. Damn. No smoking. This is a serious expose on the Prescotts. Finally. It seems like more of this is linking back to the Prescotts than I originally thought. Once home to proper fishing and tourism ministry, it's now seen better days, despite the local success of prestigious academy and the women in sports team, the Bigfoots and the Otters. Environmental change in the area have reduced the fish, limited tourism. The Prescotts managed to keep their business interests quite profitable. They're behind an expensive, exclusive housing development known as the Pan Estates. So that's where Joyce was working in the other timeline. Um, local Native Americans have already filed various motions against the development, citing widespread destruction of tribal lands and natural resources. Could that be why it's all happening? Because they're building on, like, they sacred land? It feels like it could be. And 69% of you helped Chloe. Oh, you guys That's made the same Chloe. decision as me. The bad girl's guide to guns. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Look, dad is gone. Suck it. Wow. Oh, we've Maybe already looked at this, haven't we? how innocent our drawings were compared to what we're doing now. Yeah, that is a proper juxtaposition, isn't it? Wow, that's a long word, Claire. Well done. Thanks. We've got an email here, too. I should have known just erasing that phone message wouldn't stop the police. Uh... Okay, so the police are still coming for us for breaking into the academy. I, I mean, as soon as she brought her car there, that was the first oh, dumb no. move. <gasps> the bird! The poor little bird has been trapped in here. Can we not save this bird? Why is it giving me no opportunity to save the bird? That is the most distressing part of all of this. Bird! Can I not scare it? Yeah, out of here. And then we'll open the window. Wait, I didn't open the window, did I? Oh, man. I'm about to rewind time. Please don't, like, fly into a lawnmower. Stay there. Okay, stay there. It's okay. I'm gonna open the window. And then you can be free. Okay, little burb. Now you just need to go out there, okay? Fly. Be free. Yay! Oh, the fact that the bird was trapped inside was low-key definitely stressing me out, so I'm really glad that we could actually finally Since release that bird. There, I better mosey along for a change. Does this change this ever? This be the last poster advertising Arcadia Bay after uh, tomorrow night. Okay. And that cabinet just doesn't exist in this timeline. It's just back to like the red, the hair dye and stuff. Oh, that blue dye makes me so happy. Oh. It means the real Chloe is back. I guess we couldn't have stayed in that timeline. That timeline was just like to show us, I guess, the full extent of the butterfly effect. Might as well brush my teethies, wash my facey, right? Hygiene first. Oh, you guys are back in the chat. Hello. Hello, 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 hello. Oh, it's nice to see y'all again. Didn't they see a trapped bird in their home for three days? I know, right? Why did nobody else notice this bird except me? How would you not immediately try and get the bird out of your house? Hi. Nice to chat with you guys again. If you were going to do it on YouTube, we switched the chat to emote only so that we couldn't have any spoilers during that like really emotional time. 
Um, but it's nice to see the chat again. Yep. So. Locked from the other side. And we don't have medical bills in this one. Jeez, the idea of medical birds is so bu Medical birds? Medical birds! Medical bills are so stressful. Yo, yo, Max, your friend Chloe texts me that I'm out the loop now. She sounds hot, so I get why. What? Chloe actually texted you. I sure didn't have a number. Um, at least I still get to go ape with you unless you want to chill with Chloe or we could all go. Uh, one pain in the ass is enough. Okay, I have to jet talk to you later. We didn't even know Warren in the other timeline, did we? Juliet says hello. Juliet, Juliet. You can't keep secrets from Ace Reporter Juliet Watson. I can't really remember that. Justin? Do you know Frank Bowers? Oh, wow. We were asking people. So I've spent all night texting people to try and get, like, information, I guess. One plant was stressful. Oh, you! I even killed my plant, Lisa. Your mom said you're right in the eye of the storm as well. Justin. I don't, I don't remember who half these people are. Kate. Can't wait to see you. Oh. Dad? It says... What was that? Oh. Hey, honey, I just got a text about a nosy daughter. Better stop watching others and look after herself. That's Nathan. I'm so sorry some jackass in class thought it would be funny to send. It's not. I don't like strangers having my number. Ne me neither. Sorry. I'm just being a dad. I know it's been a tough week from you. Oh, my gosh. Courtney. Hey, girlfriend. Let me know when you're going to come by my room. I'll give you a fashion makeover. I love her. Okay, thanks, Clo Courtney. I'm not with homework, but I'll check in later. And then Chloe. Sweet, I'll be ready. I know. And that was no emoji. Okay. So we've been texting people all night by the sounds of it. Trying, like, as part of our investigations. And this is where they were all before. Those poor whales are like beached angels. What so the whales are here? washed up in this timeline. I kind of, like, thought that might be the case. Joyce really wants David and Chloe to be a family. Oh, I accept your offer of dinner and a movie. Maybe Chloe would like to call, come along. I'll call you later. Oh. So because I let them make back up again, at least they're still like friendos. My and butterfly no... sketch doesn't exist in this timeline. Like William. What, what are we supposed to be doing, Max, by the way? the time bandit strikes again. Oh, wow. Look at the difference in the garden. Jeez. And it never finished getting painted, did it? William never finished painting that wall. Am I meant to be heading to school? I don't know. I like investigating, so I'm just gonna investigate everything instead. The cat's dead in every timeline, but there's no butterflies in this one. Although, I don't know why there'd be butterflies in this yard, because it's not like the other yard, is it? It's kind of trashy. Maybe the stepdad should spend less time spying on everybody and more time- David even made sure to back up the dead birds. More time, like, trying to make the house nicer, you know? Like William did. Chloe might be upset about her life being chosen, uh, but as a parent, I can assure you, William would have traded his life for Chloe's in a heartbeat. Yeah, I completely agree with that. I think any parent, given the choice of them dying or their child's life being changed in that way, they, they would pick their children every time. Oh, <gasps> he's in there. Ah! He kind of scares me, but screw it, let's go in. Screw it, let's be brave. Oh look, the jar's now a saving jar again. The swear jar. Looks like they're back on the road to Paris. I do hope these guys manage to go as well. I'm gonna do a little little sit. Penny the sheep, thank you so so much for gifting us up. Welcome to Squad New Peachy. I existed in this whole other reality, but I I don't know what happened. That's like such a heavy thing to keep to yourself, don't you I think? The more I use my power, the more I see how little control I have over what happens. It's like so heavy that only she has to deal with knows about everything. Exists in two. Or maybe three different realities. How can I have a destiny? Wow, that's heavy. That is some heavy stuff to ponder. Azeria Joy, thank you so, so much for gifting as well. And Eagle Gracie says, I'm literally sat on my bed covered in tears. And eating vegan chocolate. <gasps> Which chocolate? Vegan chocolate is the bomb. Love, love, love. Oh, oh wow. Like I think I've quite a lot to catch car up on. Maybe there's some new clues around. Tiffany Lynn 44, thank you so so much for gifting a sub. Azeria Joy, one, two, three, four. Thank you so so much for gifting four five? Five subs in the chat. Can we get some hearts in the chat for the gifters, Sorry, please? But this is my official message. Thank man you for redeeming so the hydrate. No girls allowed. Wow. Misogynist. We hate to see it. I'm gonna spy on everything before I talk to you. Should I have signed the petition? I'm just about to write the sure discussion. Isn't safe and private anymore. 
Um, I'm still interested in your feedback on other methods of improving security. We must find a middle ground. So that's because of us. We had that impact, didn't we? Surveillance cameras at Pan Estates? <gasps> David Ooh. must be working for the Prescott's too. So he's put them all up around Pan Estates as well, which is the housing complex, if you guys remember. Thank you for putting hearts in the chat, guys. Got a note here as well. Thank you what for your help with Nathan. It is important. Nathan? It is appreciated. And what did his dad do for David? What? Why are all these weird, like, characters so connected? I don't know. Oh, that makes me sad. It was so incredible to see William Aww. again. I wish Chloe could too. Okay, I guess there's nothing left to do but speak to him. Anything I can do for you, Max? I, wow, it's not like talking to I William, is there? I was just waiting there? for Chloe to get out of the bathroom so we can go. I owe you one. So I'll pretend what you just said is true, Missy. Excuse me, that's Miss Caulfield. Huh? Yes, sir. You and Chloe still better be careful where you wander. There are a lot of dark places in Arcadia Bay. What I feel like he knows places? something. Like, I can't and tell you everything that's going on Actually trying to Blackwell. protect people. And you've seen too much already, so please stay out of this, Max. Too late. I already know way too much. Like the fact that you might be working for Sean Prescott. What? Who told you that? Nathan Prescott? That little shit ass is lucky he didn't get suspended. <laughs> I don't think luck had anything to do with it. I could have been suspended too. I didn't have all the evidence at the time. I... I am sorry, Max. I like, so I can't are you hate tell this me guy. Why you think I'm working for Sean Prescott? He's abrasive, but should I tell? I, if I can rewind it, I can't. I so I might as well. I saw documents that you were hired to do surveillance and security at Pan Estates. God, damn! You are a good detective, but I didn't get hired. I gave Sean Prescott an estimate for my own reasons. Anyway, I think we can both agree it's been a hard week on all of us. Especially poor Kate Marsh. I tried to help help Kate and nobody helped Kate. I tried to help Kate. You did, Max. You saved her life like a hero while I left the goddamn dorm roof wide open. I knew Kate was feeling desperate. You even made it to the roof before me or anybody. I knew Kate was desperate too. So did Mr. Jefferson. And I got him suspended for what? That guy is an elitist prick and I'm off duty so I can say it at home behind his back. Like when Chloe calls me step douche. <laughs> artists live in a fantasy world. Why say that? Oh, he isn't like this. No, I'm kind of, I, I kind of agree. So I'm kind of going to push that? this. These art farts are all about themselves. When I was in the service, I hated the photographers who tried to pose me in their anti-war bullshit. Well, Blackwell Academy is a school for artists. So maybe this isn't the best place for you. I have a family here, Max, and I think Blackwell is the best place for me. Since only I know what's happening. What's happening? Of course, thanks to Mrs. Grant and her hippie anti-surveillance petition, I hope everybody feels safer. Like Rachel Amber and Kate Marsh. Although, you're like a walking surveillance system. <laughs> I appreciate you standing up for me, but I have to be a hard ass and tell you and Chloe to stay the hell out of this. Things are just going to get more ugly. Chloe and I can take care of ourselves. Now, excuse me, Max. I have to get back to my camera. See, I'm an artist too. Like, I definitely, like, he's, he's, he can be nasty with us, but he's never ridiculously mean. I mean, totally trust David, I but he's not a real step viewer. See what I mean? Like, maybe Chloe will see that someday. He's not as bad as we think. Oh, the car's gone. He's fixed it. Does that mean Joyce is using the car again? Oh my gosh, cars in this, like, like, entire game, I don't like. I'm like, maybe the car was better off when it wasn't being used, oh, you know? that is a serious padlock on that locker. Hey, David, what you hiding? Should I try and use it? We've got a few codes, right? <gasps> oh my gosh, does anybody remember those numbers from before? Oh, was it like one seven something? Ah! Oh. Seven ones, yeah, I've got it. Maybe I'm getting it the wrong way around, but I remember sevens and ones. You guys say do it the other way. See if that works. No yes. freaking I knew way. That would be important. Thank you, Char. I was almost there though, wasn't I? I just got them the wrong way around. Surely he's gonna hear us doing all this. Surely. Oh, <gasps> apps, 
notes, coordinates, photos of Kate, she, Kate Nathan. Kate Marsh, she knows oh, something. Yes. Wow. Has, has he fitted a tracker on somebody? Oh, he knows that Nathan punched Warren. He's got... Whose car is that? Is that... Is that Warren's car? Or is that Nathan's car? Maybe Nathan's? Rachel something? Pay up. That's us. Why has he got a picture of us? <gasps> so weird. So weird. Score. Back to Back Chloe. Back to Chloe. Now. Okay. Azaria Joy, thank you so much for gifting another sub. Penny the Sheep, thank you so much for gifting a sub. Ego Gracie says they're called Unreal Peanut Butter Cups. I found them through Little Simsy. Is Little Simsy vegan as well? Does she not eat? Does she not have dairy? I'm not sure, but that's really cool. And Shauna Jade, thank you also so so much for gifting a sub as well. Claire, maybe he knows something we don't. I 100% think he seems like he's the jerk, but I actually think 100%. Oh, <gasps> that's why the bird wants to get inside. In I, I better move his plank if I want to take the shot. Wait, but what about the? Oh, we need to get the bird. The bird the wanted to go inside for that. In That's why the bird keeps trying to get inside. I, I better move his plank. If it's like uh, dead to me. The same as the Just same as that. One picture, please. Ooh, that will have consequences. Click. Another photo from my Arcadia Bay wildlife series. Can I put the plank back? Wait, I can't. Oh yeah, I can move it back. Oh, thank you. Sleep tight, my eggy eggs. But how is the bird meant to get to the? The bird is outside now. We need to open the garage door. Kayla likes vegan stuff. Okay, that's cool. You guys are saying rewind. Rewind to lock the locker. Oh my gosh. Oh no. I don't think I can go back far enough. Okay, here we go. Is it locked again? It's locked. There we go, guys. Thank you. The locker is locked. And I think we've still got the picture. Because we've still got the thing. So we probably still have the picture, right? Uh, let's have a look. Yeah, we got the picture, guys. We all good. It's rewinded. I did the thing. The locker is locked. I always forget that I can use my powers for stuff like that. Should we call Chloe? Yeah. Yo, Chloe! Are you ready yet? I have to get back to my dorm. Are we happy? Very happy. I hit the secret file jackpot. It's Kate, Nathan, and Rachel. Plus there's some location coordinates. David is like a one-man surveillance army. What does he Let's know? Get the hell out of here before we get busted. I don't think he's a but bad I guy. I think he's to trying to help Kate us. In the hospital right now. I want to find out how she's doing. Okay, she didn't. She didn't smart talk us wanting to go see Kate. So maybe you guys are right. Maybe she's mellowing out a little bit. Maybe just having Max let the cars the cars fixed. I'm scared about the car. I'm scared about the car. But yeah, maybe having Max around her is helping to like mellow her out this a little bit. This is definitely bit. Kate's floor. Shauna J, thank you so much for gifting another sub. Welcome, Squiddy PG. But imagine how Kate feels. I'm so glad I, I get to see her again. I hope it's not too weird for her. No, she'll be stoked to see you. Who wouldn't be? This be it. I'm a little nervous. Just go in there and be your friend. I'll wait out here so you can chill by yourselves. I was a total dick for blowing a fuse when you answered Kate's call the other day. Good thing you ignored me. I had no idea what shit she was going through. And you saved her. Like me. Oh. I'm sorry. You guys, she is mellow in loads. Thanks, Chloe. But don't be sorry. We're all on the same team. Team Max. Let Kate know we're gonna string Nathan up by his balls then. Oh yes, <laughs> I'm on it. Okay. That was really nice. I'm really, I really like that. Like, Chloe seems to be, like, reflect, self-reflecting a little bit more in this reality again now. Oh. So what happens if you let her die? It must go so differently. Cause like, Matt, you, this scene would never happen. Kate. Would you go to her grave? I thought I'd never see you again. I feel so ridiculous. I'm so sorry. Kate, Aww. listen to me. You have nothing to be sorry about. 
other people do. You do not know how happy I am to see you. You look awesome. Is it a stupid question if I ask how you're doing? Now that you're here, I'm doing even better. She's I'm so, so cute, Blessa. I'm so grateful to you for coming up to the roof to talk me down. Max, I felt so lost and alone. When I saw how much you cared, how hard oh, you were trying. Oh, just missed it. You made me realize I wasn't alone. Thank you. Okay. She's so cute, isn't there she? There are so many people who love you and want to help you. I know. You should see all the letters and postcards. I gave most of the flowers to other patients here because they need them more than me. Oh, she's so I'm keeping cute. the balloons, though. One of the nurses gave me some pen and paper so I could do some drawings. She's drawing happier stuff again. I she's not drawing skulls and stuff, so that's good. They got kind of dark there for a while, but... I have an idea for a new children's book about bullying. Oh. I was thinking of having some photographs in there, too. I hope that's a subtle hint that you'll let me take the photographs for the book. Was that subtle? You better take the pictures, Max. <laughs> I'm going to be here for another day until my family comes out to visit. How are they treating you? Like they need to protect me forever. They're so upset, and I know they feel guilty even though they didn't do anything. I was surprised how many students from Blackwell wrote me. Daniel, Mr. Jefferson, even Victoria wrote me a very sweet note. And I believe she was being real. Me oh. too. So I'm maybe Victoria's kind of I'm working on it, Max. I really hope I just so. pray I can get this drawing right. Eco Gracie says, these are the last of my bits. I'm about to, I have to get in my car now and drive to my dad's. So I'm excited to watch along the way. No, if you're driving, please don't put this on. Please just, especially with this, like, so much of this being about car accidents, please do not watch this while you're driving. Just, like, watch it on more Clash of On once, once you get, like, please don't, please don't watch the stream while you're driving. Like, please, please, please don't do that, Gracie. And EVZ, thank you so, so much for subscribing. Welcome to the Peach Squad. Kate is so freaking cute. I love her. I'm so glad we saved her. Good to see that Kate is still working on her book report. Oh, I hope her family don't give her too much of a hard time. This, like, the message thing is blurry. I'm going to try and fix that. I keep missing. I need to line them up. Oh, I love Kate's Or I just need to hide one, clock. I guess. We don't need to. There we go. Oh, look at her little drawings. They're so cute. It kind of reminds me of a certain style. Like, you see that dude in the middle with his backpack? It's like a Japanese cartoon that I've seen once. Like, a really famous one, but I don't know what it's called. And look at her little balloons. I don't think get well is... Quite apropos. I propose. Hmm. Azaria Joyce's Kate is such an angel. I love her. She so is. So be it. Oh, hey, Lexi. Okay, bye. Bye, Lexi. <laughs> she Those was here for a second. And from Taylor? She's not driving. Ah, oh, okay. Oh, her sister's driving. Thank you so much for letting me know that. I got really worried. I want to keep you little peachy safe, okay? Thank you for letting me know. That is so sweet. Even Victoria signed. But not Nathan. But not Nathan. Aww. Victoria Chase might be queen bitch, but she's not evil. Victoria, I know you're not well. I know you hate me, and you should. But I only want to see you smile again. Please let me know if you need anything. Wow. So Victoria did send us something. Maybe she's not as bad as we thought. I can ask Principal her about Wells that. Principal knows how to step it up when he wants to. Uh, I want to express my deepest wish for a speedy recovery. We've organized a rally in your honor. I know my words may mean a lot in the circumstances, but it's important that, to know that we do care. If you need any assistance, please don't hesitate to ask. I'm going to see if I can chit-chat with her about her, about the stuff that Kate, I've seen. it is so good to hang out with you again. Max, I owe you so much. And I can tell you want to talk to me about something. Victoria. <laughs> I saw Victoria's letter. How does that make you feel? Max, I know Victoria can be a, uh, not nice, but I do believe in forgiveness and redemption. Oh, that's nice. I might be naive, but I feel her struggle. Me too. I could have taken a picture of her covered in paint, but I didn't, and we had a genuine moment. We all have our moments. Why do you think she acts so mean? She's probably got something going on in her own life, right? She's insecure. If you're comfortable with yourself, you don't need to act superior. Victoria doesn't look like she has much to be insecure about. If anybody could make Victoria see the light, 
It would be Kate Marsh. Mm. No. I think it will take more than that, Max. I always want to talk to you. We missed our tea session this week. Oh, that's that so was cute. That so not cool. We need to plan, like, a tea shop tour of Portland. Oh, yes. And you could bring Warren along, too. Warren? What do you think of uh, Warren? Oh, smart and silly. He's got such a good heart. And he's a cutie pie. Oh, she likes him. You know he likes you. I'm going to the drive-in with him, so <laughs> we'll see. With everything that's going on, it, a date seems weird. No. Oh, I kind of want that. Warren and Kate, Kate to get Marsh, together now. Matchmaker. Can I do I'm that? Can, that can I make that happen? Even angels need angels, Max. And then let's ask about Nathan. I want you to know I'm this close to getting all the info I need about meant to, Nathan. meant to do that. Like, Nathan Prescott close. has not to just pay I'm for this what close. he did. And we have to stop him from hurting anybody else. I wish I could have gotten his ass kicked out of Blackwell. Me too. But his dad would never let that happen. I thought I had a tough family. So what is going on with him now? Vortex Club or Prescott? Let's ask about, I think the Prescott's a bigger thing. I think his family is totally protecting him. Or worse. I never say this about people, but Max, there's something evil about the Prescotts. They have something if to do with Kate death. If even Kate thinks you're We're evil, then, you know. I just have to find Nathan's room number, get inside, and get the clues I need. Max, please let me help. I can get the number, and I'll text it to you, oh. okay? Of course, Kate. I can't do this without you. Okay, so she's going to text us, which is Nathan pretty awesome. Now it's time for watch out for us. I don't know I how she's going to do it, but I'm going to trust mission. her. So we'll keep an eye. We'll keep an eye on our text. it means to see you again. I do. That's why I love you, Max. Thanks for taking care of my bunny. <gasps> we need to Tell feed the Alice bunny. We'll see her soon. We've not fed Alice. We, we need to go feed Alice. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Ooh, there's a picture over here. Can we look at this? Is this her sisters? Thank you, sisters. Uh, you really saved Kate. They're so cute, aren't they? Uh, Cat... Canitude Gray, thank you so so much for being here for two months. I'm glad you're enjoying the streams. And Emily6738 says, I just got here, you look beautiful today as always. Oh Emma, thank you so so much. I feel oily today. I feel oily. Jim Bunny, thank you so so much also for subscribing using your Twitch Prime. That's awesome. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, let's head back to Chloe. Posture check, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Well, how is she? She's still Kate Marsh. Thank God. I'm glad we came to see her. You could have Thanks said hi as well. Thanks for coming with me. Now let's go pay a visit to Nathan Prescott. Yes. That little prick is not going to be glad when he sees us. Yes. Remember the quote, I am so tired of people controlling me. Who was it that said that? I can't remember. Hydrate, I've run out. I've run out of hydration juice. I got some final droopy drops. Ali walked by a bit ago. I should have asked him to top up, but I totally forgot. It seems quieter here now. Look at the little drone flying around. I wonder if she's seen anything with a drone, you know? And that's the teacher that was, didn't want the surveillance, and that's the sweet, like, janitor guy. Hey, Max. How you doing? Oh, hi, Mr. Jefferson. I'm okay. Um... And this is my friend, Chloe. Yeah. Mm. Chloe? Why isn't somebody as cool as you going to Blackwell? I was way too cool for this school. It's a long story. In actual files here. I can imagine. Max, are you sure that you're all right? It's weird just being on campus. Like I don't trust this normal. guy. I know. Lame as it sounds, life has to go on. I think there's too much going on in my life. I don't know. There's just something about on him that, that I don't note, trust. Blackwell duty calls. Remember, I'm going to announce the winner of the <gasps> Everyday Heroes contest tonight at the party. So I hope you'll be there to celebrate. Ali Even though I'm sorry you didn't enter a photo. I understand your reasons. You can't force an artist <gasps> to work. What? I, I should have entered one. So I took so many. You don't hate me for what I said to the principal? Was I meant to have submitted one? Have I I'm missed that? I'm for caring so much Oops. about a troubled friend. And I take hope in the fact that you have plenty of time to find your way. Just... Get in the habit of putting your work out there. Thanks, Mr. Jefferson. I'll definitely be there tonight. Me too. I'll Ali? be Max's date. 
You better dance with us at least once. <laughs> Nobody should have to see me dance. Thank Plus, you, you don't want to watch the old hipster trying to keep up with the kids. I'll give you some, some pesh. Pride. Some Be boxing or just yes, you will. Hot for teacher. <gasps> oh, she likes the teacher. You're out of control. Not yet. Just wait until the rager tonight. <sighs> Shut up. Don't be jealous because Mark Jefferson thinks I'm cool. I am so ignoring you. Fine. Since I'm here, I'll see if I can get some dirt from Justin. I haven't talked to him in a while. Who's well, Justin? That is a great plan. Is Justin the like sk stoner skater guy? I feel like they would be friends. That kind of makes sense. Thank you so much, Let's Boba. Let's see if I can find out where Nathan you. is. Hmm. So are we going to the party tonight or are we going to go ape at the drive-in? Will that be like a decision we have to make? I don't know. Daniel texted her, didn't hey, Daniel. he? Daniel. You look bummed out. Are you all right? Daniel texted Kate. Hello, Max. I just figured out that my photos basically suck. Yeah, but you're an awesome at artist. drawing. Look at it. Look at his um his top is like um Oh, what do they call that meme with the guy, the neck beard. He's got a neck beard on his top. You're not here to be a photographer. That's my gig. Look at that sketch you did of me. Incredible. And that's your art. Your gift. <sighs> I do feel better now. You are good, Max. Would there have been like something that would have happened with him if we hadn't talked to him? Or is it only really Kate that has that? Have you talked to anybody about Fedora, the lady? Exactly. I don't talk to anyone, Max. But I did actually have a nice talk with Brooke. She couldn't stop talking about how brave you were on that roof. I don't think doing the right thing is brave, but I appreciate what she means. Oh, he took a picture of us next to that tree. The most important thing is that Kate gets better. You know that the picture that and I couldn't see because the light was on I it? That, it Max. was Max She's next to this tree, wasn't it? She's the most genuine person I've ever met. Uh, I don't mind getting picked now. on by Blackwell makes bro sense holes. Now. But don't fuck with Kate. I like this revolutionary Daniel DaCosta. Only if I can start the revolution from my sketchbook, Max. Uh, let's ask about Nathan. By the way, I like have his you seen Nathan too. Prescott? You mean lately? Like, any time today? I saw Jefferson talking with Nathan a little while ago, but uh, I try to stay out of his way. I have enough assholes to deal with here. And end of the world party. Are you going to the end of the world party tonight? It will be if I go, man. People here push me into lockers, not dance floors. Oh. Go to the party or don't go. I don't want to force him if he's not going to be happy, but if we see him, we'll talk to him, so... That's exactly why you should go to that party. We have to stand up to these Blackwell bullies for Kate. You won't be alone, Daniel. Not with you to back me up, Max. Oh, damn it. I will go to the party like it is the end of the world. Is that is it a good okay, thing to I make him go, go or not? I don't no, know. I that, but I'll go. I don't know if I need later. to try and like encourage okay, as many allies to go almost. So I'm going to kind of play it like that. Who's this dude? Okay, he does not want to talk to us. Fine, rude. How about you? Do you want to talk to us? Zach, hi. No. Enjoy the big game, Zachary. I hope it's not the last. Ooh, I think we can take a picture of this. Yeah, I remember seeing that. The little stones. One photo. For posterity. It's kind of cool with the thing in the background, though. Nice, nice, nice. Love adding a little photo to the collection. Where was it? Ah! It's, we just took it, but it's not done it. That's so weird. You came, my love. Um. Because there aren't any in the kitchen anymore. Um. Listen here. There's no one to be back from as well, though. Um. I'll have to take that one. Yeah, grab those ones. I don't know why my little photo didn't show. That's so rude. Rude. Oh, there we go, guys. There we go. Should I, was I meant to have uh, like entered a photo to that competition? I kind of feel worried that I've messed that up. That's so ironic that Warren asked <gasps> Max to be driving. Brooke, hey, Brooke, so Brooke How is chit chatting with Drawing I'm dude. here as usual. By Daniel. the way, thanks for helping Kate down. Are you okay? Uh, whales or drone? Should we ask about her drone again? I might feel better taking your drone for a quick flight. Miss Grant finally gave up and let me fly her again. But you're going to the drive-in with Warren, so you don't have time to fly my drone. Oh, she's really? into Warren. 
I can't fly your drone because I'm going to see ape movies with Warren? You are perceptive, Max. Now, excuse me. My drone needs me. Well, especially what talks was you now. later, Max. Okay, definitely rewind that and don't ask her about the drone because she's salty about Max and uh Hey Brooke, how are you? She's I'm salty here. she she's into um Warren, That's isn't so she? Warren I need to find right? Nathan. Have you seen him around? Ask Warren. I mean, you're going to the movies with him and everything. Oh my okay, gosh. But, um, but right now I'm trying to find Nathan. She's super salty, super salty. I, I can't get my limited brain around that eclipse and the Yeah, she's really into Warren. They got together in the I other timeline. The science department had some ideas. Warren. Maybe I should have asked Warren to go. Oh, what? Do you see that? It kind of, uh, it, it kind of, I don't know what she said. I don't know what she said. Oh, he asked you? You know, science geeks stick together. But honestly, neither of us can explain this phenomenon. It's pretty scary. I think they were just asking about the whalings, weren't they? I okay. have to go. Talk later, Brooke. Good. Nathan is not around. I should go back to Chloe. Hi, little squigs. Hi. Did you think you could hide from Max Caulfield, squirrel paparazzi? Wait, do I get to take a picture? Wait, it won't even let I me take a picture. Another batch of dead birds today. A what? Uh... Sad. Makes me mad. Climate change isn't real, my ass. They're all on about their uh, little birdies. How are you doing, Max? Been a tough week. I like this guy. I, know. I think he's sweet. Yes, it has, Samuel. He's upset about the birds as well. He loves nature. Sad and confused, like everybody else in Arcadia Bay. He looks so you much look like, like you, have a lot of you know, in Toy Story 2. The guy who's like, he, he takes uh, Woody and he paints the dolls. He looks like him. How did I not realize this until now? He is Toy Story 2. He is pure Toy Story 2. I still have a million Don't questions you think? about what's happening to Arcadia Bay. That must be yes, why Miss him. Dad says you're one of her favorite Al students. Al from Al's Toy Barn. So does. It so does. I keep thinking that Rachel Amber has a few answers. If we can find her. If Rachel wants to be found. You think she's alive? Or where is she? Do you think she's alive? She'll always be alive in our hearts. Sometimes that's all we have left. But... Max, all I can tell you is to stay on your path and you'll find what you're looking for. Rachel Amber is waiting too. Hmm, don't really know if that helps or not. Even though I Ms. feed Grant the bunny, don't me, worry, I will do. I have zero science skills to explain that eclipse. As I was just saying to her, that's because science has no explanation. Well, no offense to Miss Grant here, but this is just the beginning. How do you know? A beginning of what? I'm gonna say beginning of what? Beginning of what? Oh, I, I don't believe anything ever ends. Especially time. That's why I can sense something bigger is coming to Arcadia Bay. This science teacher's just Max, like, what is he talking about? I don't like it at all. Vortex Club. I'd rather be in her class than the Vortex Club. Yes, you would. Rachel saw right through them. She's not the only one. Nobody should be trapped in the Vortex Club. Get out now, Max. He knows something. While time is on your side. Time is always on our side, though, because we control time. I definitely have questions about what's happening to the animals in Arcadia Bay. Oh, many do. These poor creatures have no choice in what happens to them. Beach whale squirrels or birds? I want to ask about the whales. How can anybody explain all those poor beached whales? My dad was a fisherman, and he'd take me out to hear the whales sing. Now they... they just cry. Eco disaster, or they're not alone. Eco disaster. Do you think this is some kind of eco disaster, or? I think it's more than that. I did. He got me some juice. Somebody is causing all this to happen. You think so, Samuel? You and Arcadia. Did you Bay see the sky flash then? It's happening. So I think it was a glitch. Next time I have a question, I'm coming to you. Uh, burbies. What do you think about all those dying? This guy. Birds? We're having a long chat with Sydney this guy. Huckleberry. Dozens near the Tabanga. Tabanga? Oh, it's the thing Is that over there. Is cool with the Tabanga? 
That's the We'll find monument. out if the souls of the bird move on. Not that we can prove it. It's so ominous. Unless it's fate. Then it doesn't matter. Jeez, that was a heavy, well, glad to heavy see conversation. Is so healthy and happy on the campus. Me too. If something happened to them, oh. Not as long as you're here to take care of them, Samuel. The he loves the squirrels. They're like his food. spirit animal, right? Lots of food. Okay. Which reminds me that, that I have to feed them now. Oh, we might be able to get a picture. Oh, little squigs. Ah. They're cute, but these are the I gray squirrels. Yeah. You the gray I'm squirrels fascinated. make it so that As we our red squirrels are gone in the UK. Photo. How would you like a partner? Ooh. The yeah, the, the, the gray squirrels came to, to America, uh, uh, came, to England, America. Sure. Yeah, the gray squirrels came to America, uh came to England from America. And they're like They've adapted better than our red squirrels did, so all the UK red squirrels are dying. Which is so sad. So sad. Can I try and take a picture of both of them now? How do I do this? Are you gonna go over there? Good. Yes. Nathan is not around. Yes! I should go back to Chloe. Squiggle photo. Best photo. Cuties. Are they eating a donut? Jeez, he treats them well. Or a pretzel or something. Fair play to him. Fair play. There we go. Okay, I'm just gonna catch up with some messages real quick. Sassy Soda, thank you so, so much for subscribing. Michaela Hummel says, rewind, there is something new you can ask Brooke. Oh, I'm so sorry I missed that. Uh, Adigan says, don't forget to feed the bunny. I won't. Solar Nai has also shown some love with some bits as well. And JYN Bunny has also subscribed using their Twitch Prime. Thank you guys so, so much. Um, I don't think, yeah, I don't think I can do anything with Brooke now. She's, she's so salty with us. Are you sure us. you're all right? Oh, no, I, look, it's only the drone again, and asking her about the drone uh, makes Ms. her, like, Grant. super salty, really? so. You. Yeah, look. Talk to you like She's not, she's not, she don't want to be our friend because Warren likes us, which is, like, so high school, Sam, but I guess they are in high school, Max? so, you know. Hi, Miss Grant. Max, you always show up when I'm talking about she's you. She's so cute, look at her little piece of I'm bowl. still bragging about little you necklace. and the other students making Blackwell surveillance free. Hmm. Should we ask her about Nathan? I was looking for Nathan Prescott, and I thought he might be in your class. I'm surprised, man. So, so I didn't think you and Nathan were exactly so friends. Lana Yai. Thank you so, so much for cheering. Study partners? Just study partners. I can't believe he does have friends. That depends what your definition is. But I'd like to see more friendships at Blackwell, less bullying. Especially after this week. Me too, Miss Grant. So, you don't know where Nathan where is? is? he? Where's Victoria as well? I saw him sulking off campus earlier. But you look like you have more on your mind than a question. Ooh, recent events. I was hoping you could explain some of these crazy things happening in Arcadia Bay. If I could, I'd be collecting my Nobel Prize in science today. I haven't been able to wrap my mind around that eclipse, much less the snow in Wales. It is weird. Maybe the, um... The eclipse that doesn't do with the moon? Nothing is beyond science, to do with the moon? except for our lack of knowledge. So we may never know why, but that doesn't change If there was an reality. eclipse that there shouldn't have been, I am worried about it might mess with the sea, which messes with the whales. I feel like it's changing That's right in front of us. You and Samuel both. We were talking about that before you came over. Look at the drone. Our planet is changing, on us. but it's not mystic. It's erosion. Dying animals. You think that's why all these animals are dying here? Well, our shoreline has been receding, not to mention the daily contamination of the ocean. That's all you need to kill off sea and wildlife here, unless you know something I don't. Time travel or Tobago. Time travel. What about wormholes and chaos theory? I like the time travel stuff. The only wormholes in Arcadia Bay are underground, and chaos theory is just that. But if this is about time travel, sign me up. Maybe we should have spoken Would to her from really the start. Would you really change time? Not after reading that Bradbury story, A Sound of Thunder. I won't give it away, but it involves dinosaurs and butterflies. Time is like a thread, Max. One tug and it all can unravel. Ooh, I feel like they used that in the trailer for this game. That's such a good line. I don't think surveillance would have helped Kate Marsh. 
Who needs surveillance when we have Maxine Caulfield? You did a wonderful thing. And now we have to make sure Kate gets the help she needs. Do you need to talk to a counselor? Blackwell needs help, Ono thinks. Blackwell Academy needs the help. There's something terrible going on here. You see it, right? This week hasn't been Blackwell's finest hour. But me and some faculty members won't rest until all the students here feel safe. Max Not after bullied. the conversation. Kate was I know, right? It's at kinda the Vortex heavy. Club party and bullied by them until she ended up on the roof. How do you stop that? Shut down that damn Vortex Club for a start. I don't mean to get riled up, but that party should have been postponed. It's extremely tasteless given what happened with Kate. It's so true, actually. That's the Prescotts though, right? Do the Prescotts have anything to do with the Vortex Club? I mean, they don't get all their money from car washes. No, they don't. But membership has its privileges. Especially when your father is Blackwell's biggest sponsor. This elitist nonsense has no place here. You're right. I, I just wish this could be the school that I dreamed about before I came here. I hear you, Max. I love seeing you and Warren and all my students at your best here. But you're all too young to be so cynical. But you truly give me hope. I'm sorry, Miss Grant. I, I have to get going. I I'll see you later. She's such it's an awesome teacher. It's always good talking to you, Max. It's so nice, like, teachers that care, like, that much about their students. I think it's really nice anyway. Okay. I'm gonna head inside because I really want to feed this bun bun. Wait, that's the boys' dormitories. Huh? Why can't I go to the girls? I need to feed the bun bun. Why will no one let me feed the bun bun? Oh, great. Chloe stole money from the handicapped wow. access fund. That is now. a proper, like, is that irony? Like, oh my gosh, look at this. Alyssa, why you play hard to get when you already hard to want? Wow. Um, are we at the boys one? Why are we at the boys one? I don't know, but she stole money to that they were going to use to, like, make the school wheelchair friendly. How crazy is that? And then this timeline, I guess, it, like, Chloe herself doesn't need it, but still. I knew it would be those two being friendos. Coast is clear. It would be so cool if you and me were going to school here together. But now you can have Mr. Jefferson all to yourself. Ugh, you suck. Now let's get into Blackwell Ninja mode. Well, they didn't make it for in the other timeline. I know, right? Azaria Joy, thank you so, so much for using uh, your pr uh, your bits for some pride emotes and love you so much, Claire. Thank you, love you too. Solanaya, also using more bits. So thank you so, so much. I still don't know if I'm saying that name right. I'm so yes, sorry. I want Nathan, Nathan said, I'm so tired door. of people controlling me. Remember that. Okay. He did say that. Right here. Give me the signal if Nathan or anybody shows hey, up. I won't let you down, Batmax. Hey, Papa. The window's no, closed now. You can't get out that way. Room. Okay. Wait. Kate said she texts us a number. Nothing from Kate. Hmm. Can we not text her first? Please send me the number. You said you would. Apparently, Logan missed this poster. Wow. <laughs> The Vortex Club sucks ass. Oh my gosh, Kate! Kate, you are awesome, thank you. It's 111. I love that you bring out the rebel in me. You are already a rebel, trust me. Always, and please be careful, promise. Of course, I'll keep you posted. I know you will. Hmm, <laughs> she's so cute. Okay, 111. Oh, Kate. Evan. Of course. That's why no shits were given. Evan is the one Evan that rolls. Chloe was talking to just then, right? And what's this? Skateboarding is not a crime. Oh, or maybe that's it. Hello, Trevor and Dana. Oh no, I don't want to be listening into that. No, 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 no. Thank you. No thanks. Don't want to listen to the people do woo woos. Left. So casual gamers, your time is over. It, oh my gosh, this would be our group, wouldn't it? Gamer guys, what the hell? Misogynist! Every week we play and analyze a new game from COD to WoW, from strategies to shooters, game on. I want to talk about Call of Duty and World of Warcraft. Why won't you let me join the gang? Rude. Zack or Logan? Who knows? Bro's got a bro. Yeah, there are uh, people in this 18. I can see you guys talking about that in the chat. Oh my gosh, toilet paper. Always toilet, toilet paper. paper wars mandatory in the dorms? Okay, so 1111. What's this one? 106. Icon has arts. Who's Even this? after Kate. 
Nobody hey. here learned anything about bullying. Wait, oh, do you reckon this is Daniel's room and they're taking the mick out of him? Wow. Wow. Oh, jerks. At least nobody messed with the Kate portrait. Cry, hipsters, cry. Wow, what? Why are people gonna be so mean? The Kate portrait was awesome, though. And then, so what's that one? 107. And then, this is Nathan's room. The press courts rule this town. Even without Kate's, I think we could have guessed what it would have been. Not safe for work. Okay, I just want to check everyone else's out. It's all good in the woods. Ugh, skunk weed and video games. I sense Hayden is near. You guys are saying change war and slate. Wait, this one? Daniel Slate. I can't change that one. Which one's Warren's room? There is no unique picture of reality. Stephen Hawking. Hello, this is Warren. Warren's room. <laughs> Hawking and him make a good team. I can write. I can have a little fun with Warren for a change. I mean, he's the one who wants to go ape. And sometimes you have to take a chance and see what happens. What, what, what? Please, please. Are you made of copper and delirium? Because you're cute. What? Poor Warren. Wow. This is the work of Nathan. He's Can so we take that down? I'm a pacifist. Why can't we take that down? That's horrible. What a rat. Sorry, Looks Kate. Looks like one of the jocks did care about Kate. I wonder who this is. Sassy Soda, thank you so, so much for cheering with the bits. Okay, Nathan's slate. Let's head in. I want to protect Daniel. Daniel and Warren need protecting. Oh, we're going to smash our way in. Yes, rebels. Wow. Jeez. We have changed since episode one. I'm kind of here for it. Okay. The wow. A projector? He's got a massive projector. But the sofa now doesn't face the projector. Phone. That well, would be so annoying, but you can clues. watch it from bed. Joyce. Max, I appreciate you signing up for David. I know Chloe didn't like that, but she needs to stop. Stand up and stop acting out so much. Except that won't happen if you and her are getting mixed up in our legal crap like breaking into Blackwell at night. I know what happened, so don't bother to try and defend or explain. I hoped you would get her back on track, but it looks like she's getting stuck again. David wants to help, but she won't let him. You used to be such a good influence on her unless you both want to play bad. I'm so sorry, Joyce. Even I got into shenanigans, but I'm trying to be a good influence on, Kay on Chloe. I know, Max. I forget you're still teenage adults. Oh, Joyce is so worried about her. It's kind of an intense message to send us, but I guess she's worried it's about so Chloe. so cute and ironic. The best son in the world. I can't believe Nathan still has it around. This is the best son in the world. From his dad. Huh. I thought he'd have a strange relationship with his dad, but it looks I like really he doesn't. I really hope they were all consenting models. Oh, wow. That is somebody all, like, tied up from behind. That is so Chloe. Hey, asshole, we need to talk or I'm going to tell everybody what you did and you're going to pay. Oh, my God. <gasps> Chloe. Oh, Chloe. What? How has he got this picture of her? She looks gone. Look at her eyes. What has what is happened with Chloe there? Why does he have a picture of Chloe? What? I'm not turning on his MP3 player. That must be the lamp Chloe broke when Nathan drugged her. <gasps> she told us the story. I totally forgot. She told us that Nathan drugged her, but she managed to get away. He brought her here. Oh my gosh. I forgot. I totally forgot that. <gasps> Rewind to fix the door. Thank you guys. I totally would have forgotten to do that. So now we're already inside the room. But the door is fixed. Okay, there we go. Thank you. Is this just going to be music? Whale songs? Maybe this is the only soothing thing Nathan ever hears. He listens to whale songs. That's super interesting because the whales have been washed up. So if you guys are wondering in the chat, I now remember. Chloe told us that Nathan, like, drugged her and brought her back to his room, but she managed to fight him. However, she must have taken a picture. Brand new and cost about six grand. Wow. His Pastor. parents are rich, I guess. So that must be what the, the photo is from. I totally forgot about I that. I thought Victoria had the photo bling, but once again, the Prescott's rule. What else have we got? Prescription pills. We've seen these before. I don't think this prescription has helped Nathan. 
He's definitely in a dark place, but that doesn't really excuse drugging people and bringing them back to your room, does it? I'd cry too if I had him for a father and had to wear that suit. Oh, that is a cute suit though. Look at the little sailor outfit. I like I like the sailor outfit. Okay, his PC Nathan background's messed way up. Into this party. Hey gorgeous, just let you know what you went to the closet set this week. I can wear something just as silent and expensive. I'm who's this from? I'm psyched about going and picking up some serious pate favors. I even told my dad to keep the pigs away from Blackwell so we can wreck, get wrecked without hustle. If we're going to the end of the world theme, let's let's do it on point, right? Who is that from? Oh, it's Victoria. Nathan sent that to Victoria. Okay. Oh, bastard. Wow. Now I remember why I hate you. Kate's gone and wild. And why Kate will get justice. It's still on the internet then. Oh man. Nate's Sean. Sean Prescott might be Nathan's real problem. Nate, I know this has been a stressful week for, and your mother and I are here to talk if needs be. Just make an appointment anytime. Your mother wants Dr. Bill to come out of, come out after his book tour, but for now, let's just stitch your prescriptions. I need you to be calm and quiet while the pan estates have been developed. I know being a Prescott is a burden, and I'll guide you into this room step by, by, step, by step, as did my father. It was hard for me when my dad opened my eyes to my destiny, but you'll thank us someday. Don't worry about Blackwell. This town is going to get an enema along with a fresh brand. I want you to be ready to take over when that mo moment is right. Don't mess it up. What does he mean? It was hard for me when my dad opened my eyes to our destiny, but you'll thank me someday. That makes me think something way bigger is going Too bad on. Nathan isn't more like his sister. She sounds awesome. And far away. She's in Brazil. I brag to all my co-workers the peace. She's in the peace corps. Uh, and she doesn't he doesn't reply to her enough. Mum told you you've been in trouble. I know I love dad, but I'm a jungle halfway across the world because of him. So she left because she hates the 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 family. Don't let him change her into one of the family legacy. End of lecture. You're in school, so I just want to make you feel at home. Okay, interesting, interesting. Yes, Nathan sure needs diet pills. Diet this pills? Is strong stuff. What? Diet suppressant? Why is he taking diet suppressant pills? This, like, I don't understand everything to do with him, he but there's a everything. lot. Holy shit. And he's got a gun. That's the gun Nathan used uh, on Ah, a gift from. A gift from... Who, who, who? Does it say? Holy shit. No. That's the gun Nathan used on Chloe. Maybe the pills aren't for him. Oh, <gasps> sleeping him. pills. No, diet suppressant pills. Ah, why would he need diet suppressant pills? I thought there were sleeping pills for a moment. Nathan likes his tortured subjects way too much. These films all have a dark pattern. Oh man, Nathan's messed up. Nathan is messed up. I mean, we kind of knew that, but... That looks like a totally fun show. Even Nathan has <gasps> Look at the side. pictures at the side. Guys, what is going on? It's really weird. He's so weird. Damn, Nathan. That's a nice shot. It's so damn creepy, but the guy has his own style. So he's actually pretty, I mean, he's got an amazing camera, so he has no excuse to want to be good, I guess. I don't think one <laughs> book can guide the press. Guys. Rage on. A teen parent guide to anger management. That's that Dr. Bill that got mentioned in the email. Jeez, there is so much to this room. I don't fully feel like I understand everything though. He's got a picture of his dad at the top there. You see that? Yeah, I still don't feel like I understand everything. Oh, <gasps> scratch marks. That's probably from Chloe. What the hell are all those marks on the floor? I think we've, I think we've looked at everything. I don't think there's anything I'm missing. Okay, there's definitely a door map around here. A door map? Wait, why do we need a door mark? Map, the projector. Yes, I would be cool with having this high-tech projector. What is he playing, though? That's so, like, creepy to just have in your room. I yeah, I think we've seen everything, the guys. Bling, but once the couch. Again, you guys are saying go on the sofa. Rule. Oh. Let's find out what you're hiding. Oh, good shout, guys. I would have missed that. Wow. Oh, yes, little phone. You are mine now. We've got a phone. Okay, I think that's everything. Now I have Nathan's phone, so I can show it to Chloe. Well, before Nathan comes back. Okay, I want to get out of here because I feel a bit nervous. So let's cool. get out. Now it's open. You guys saying turn off the projector? I don't think I could do anything with it. I've moved the couch. Is that everything? I can't go back in anyway. I think the family legacy is something super ominous. 
Gotta look closer. You guys are saying rewind. But I won't be in there anymore. Oh yeah, I am. Okay. Wait. No, I'm not in there anymore. I can't get in anymore. It's it's fine. I checked the drawer. The sofa. I put the sofa back. I think we're all good. I think we're all good. So let's go tell Chloe. Damn, Max, you're finally back. I got worried. So what did you find? His room was clean and creepy. Michaela, thank you for the Check rewind tip. Out. Boom, Nathan. We got you by the balls, fucker. Why didn't she give her the picture? What are uh -oh. you doing in my dorm? Uh-oh. She's scared You're of him. You're such a nosy bitch, Max. Stop right there, Nathan. Make me ho. He's got scratch Max, marks on his face I as well. <gasps> no, don't Get start this fight again. <gasps> Jeez. Wow. You are so fucking dead. <gasps> a gun. What? Get this just me, escalated bro. quickly. <gasps> Get off me, brah. <laughs> Stay out of it or stop him. I think we should stop for sure. Warren, stop it! Come on. Oh, oh my head! Why are y'all looking at me like that, huh? You and you—you're all dead. Uh oh. He's not gonna use it Let's on us. Go. Now. Plus, my dad is on his way. You're all fucked. He owns you. Okay, I did not expect that to go the Even way that it if did. Nathan definitely deserved a beating. We should try to be better than that. I think I did the right thing. Good choice. I hate seeing people get beat up. I hate it. Only Kai can use bra. Exactly. You know what I mean? <laughs> wow, that got seriously intense. That was intense. That's what I just said. Warren. We got Thank so, so lucky much. there. For what? For headbutting Nathan Prescott. That was awesome. <laughs> I don't know. I almost went crazy there. Like Nathan. You're not anything like him. Good to know. So where are you going? I better stick with you guys. Just in case you need me to get my Hulk on again. Or should I call the cops on Nathan? I don't no think the police. cops are gonna do anything. Not yet. They own the town, right? Uh, so maybe you better... Um... Warren, me and Max have to do this on our own. No offense. It's Aww. cool. Whatever I can do to help. Oh, I what thought it'd be kind of cool rolling around together. It's like a little, like, all three of us. I'm on it. Between the snow and eclipse, I'm assuming the apocalypse is around the corner. And oh, thank we you. don't really get to know Warren Seriously. very well, do we? I'll call you later. You better. I'm feeling pretty alpha now. Yes, you are. Don't be alpha. It's fine. Ignore alpha and beta. They're so dumb. They're so dumb. Man, that guy is so fucking in love with you. I know. He really did give a serious beat down to Nathan. It was a little scary to watch him do that. Now let's make a date with Frank. Will he even answer you? Frank always answers when he wants money. Wait, why are we- oh, are we doing it just to give them money, but this is like making said, me nervous. Frank wants to see me right now. Let's not keep him waiting. Did I get everything I could have got then? I hope I did. They're saying that you shouldn't stop Warren. But like, what, is it we just gonna watch him beat him to death? I don't think that's a good idea. It's too late now, I can't go back. I think once I left the dorms, like, that was it. Warren is 16. What, well, Warren's younger than Max? I didn't realize that. I thought everyone was 18. I wish we got more Warren time. God. I hate seeing those poor whales like that. Me too. I just think of their families in the ocean out there looking for them. Well, that asshole's gonna help us find Rachel. Hey, Jazeel. You know what would be great? If I still had a gun. You yes, guys saying watch my mouth on this scene, okay? Just about even the odds here. Frank would scare better. He's a pussy. Besides, if I take him out, you can just rewind. Mm -mm. Chloe, do not count on my rewind. Seriously. After Kate, I Illuminati like confirmed. Look, every time you see I do, it? it might be the last. There's no way we could have guessed this is what would happen to us when we grew up. 
I'm looking forward to the day when we can just go on a road trip to Portland. Fuck yeah. You, me, and Rachel. Absolutely. So let's play this cool, okay? Just pay Frank his money, and then we can get that code for the book from him. That's all. Got it. No dicking around. Let's roll. Off the dragons, thank you so, so much for being here for two months. I know you can tell I've got loads of fluff on my hand, because Darcy's back on my desk, so I keep trying to get all these notes. And uh, Guld Guldalise, thank you also so much for being here for two months as well. Hope you guys are enjoying the stream. I didn't get the chance to, ugh, oh, oh my gosh, so much hair in my mouth. I didn't get the chance to um, check on the bun bun, which is really annoying, but I'm assuming it's going to be fine, because it didn't even give me an option to go into girls' dorms. The forest seemed quiet. No sign of life. Or deer. The deer are important. I feel like we spend a lot of this game following deer, or like deer being a really important part of it, you know? Ooh. Can we Frank do doesn't speaky? need tinted windows when they're this dirty. Are we gonna go straight to him? Can I not do a little bit of investigations first, please? Like we've got these bottles here. Behold, Frank's, Frank's beer, beer garden. garden. Wow. And then there's a sign it over here. It blows my mind that I was just here with Chloe. <gasps> this is where reality. we walked, isn't it? This is where we walked Could together. Could actual cops around to bust us. Wow. Very different. Very different this time around. Take the trash out sometime, dude. And then a little table. This is where Frank ponders his existence. And gets drunk. It's kind of like, Frank's life is kind of sad. I think, I don't know if he was maybe happier when Rachel was there. Oh, fresh meat. So Pompidou must be okay. Good doggy. <gasps> so if I let Pompidou go into the road, would there have not been any meat there? I don't know. But yeah, I'm wondering if what happened with Rachel is the reason why Frank's so messed up. I don't know. Oh, look. The Wonder Twins. Oh, yeah. Chloe threw his key come on the along. roof. She's my partner. Yeah, we're bodyguard. So let's get to business. Where's my fucking money? Wow. Give him the money or keep the money. I'm just gonna give him it. I, like, th this dude has a gun. Let's not be stupid. Oh, I thank you. That wasn't so hard now, was it? And let's not do any more business again. Now, if you excuse me. Frank? Could we ask you a couple quick questions? You have some serious lady balls. No. Jesus, okay. <laughs> okay. But I'm not getting you high. Frank. We're not here to get high. No, you don't look like the type. Not like Chloe here. So what do you hardy boys want? Just the names of some of your clients. Oh, is that all? Oh, well, why didn't you just tell me? How about I just give you the keys to my RV while I'm at it? You don't get a help or else, or I'm sorry. I don't want to threaten him, so I'm just going to be like, you don't get it. You don't get it, man. This is for a good cause. No, man, I do not get it. Especially from a weirdo like you. Okay, you know, I hate the way you talk to me like you, like you know more than I do. No, no, I'm not. I, I... Oh, Christ, I hate you, Blackwell. Shit. You expect everything for free. You're okay, not this was not the right way me. to go. I work for a living, you understand? Yes, Frank. Without those Blackwell shits as customers, you wouldn't have any work at all. Dude, you're a drug dealer. Yeah, right, okay. Both of you are giving me a headache. No deal. Okay, that right. way doesn't work. We didn't come here to fight. This is so much bigger than us. Oh yeah, you didn't come here to fight. A day after, you pulled a fucking gun on me. He's got a good I, point, though. <laughs> I am so sorry about that. It might be the dumbest thing I've ever done. And I've done a lot of dumb things this week. Finally, I believe you. But don't ever aim a gun at anybody unless you intend to kill. Although you don't look like you could kill a bug. I... I try not to. And I never would have pulled the trigger. I was just... We didn't even pull it, Dude, did we? Dude, she was scared, all right? You pulled your blade on me. We were all freaked out. Now we're all cool. Please? Okay. 
We're cool for now. But my dog isn't. And if you try any shit, he will bite your head off. He's done it before. We're only here to talk. I wouldn't mess with your dog. Shit, you wouldn't have time. You like dogs? <laughs> you like dogs? Pompidou is cute. Gave dog a bone, dog rescue. Oh man, Car you guys are saying careful. Posture check, thank you, thank you, thank you. I think we should just talk about how cute Pompidou is, because he is. You guys tell me to rewind. I'm trying to be nice. Give a dog a bone, oh my gosh, no. Uh, talk about the dog rescue? Yeah. Of course I do. I heard you even rescued a bunch of fight dogs. That's amazing. No, all right, it was just the right thing to do. Okay. I couldn't stand to see those poor animals treated like, like slaves. <gasps> Darcy, don't That's kick my microphone. That's very cool. Rude. Your dog is lucky you came along. Maybe we can focus on rescuing Rachel now. Rachel? Is Did that I do the right thing? Really here? Yes, we're so close to Don't say the name. Now, no, you guys all we say need no. All the help we can get now, especially from you. You and Chloe do not know Rachel like I did, and I couldn't even help her. You guys say no. You're way over your heads. Why don't you just go play in your clubhouse? You know Rachel? Rachel's letter or the bracelet? Oh, guys, what's it, what do I do here? What are you hiding? I don't want to make him angry. Oh, I, maybe saying you do know Rachel, that's why we need your help. If we, if we talk about the Rachel's letter or the bracelet, then that would just make him too angry, right? She didn't say his name. Yeah, I didn't say the dog's name. I'm gonna, like, saying that you know Rachel is, like, giving him the power, so I feel like that's a good thing to do. I'm so nervous at getting things wrong. You guys are saying do a hydration thing. Okay. You guys said about the letter, you know Rachel. Oh, you guys, I don't know which one to go for. Bracelet. This is stressful. Darcy, stop kicking my microphone. He, I think he knows that you know about the bracelet. I'm going to try you know Rachel. Frank, you knew Rachel almost better than anybody. And you know more than us. Together, we could find her. Do you have anything to lose? When Rachel vanished, I pretty much lost everything. I can't stand not knowing where she is. Not hearing her voice or her laugh anymore. We can change all that. It's up to you. Help us find her, Frank. Please. We really need your client list. Please? Please tell me I did the right thing. Well, if there's a chance in hell, you two dorks can find Rachel. And I'll take it. Okay, I feel like My that was a good move. barking at you, so I guess that's a good sign. Wow, he just keeps his client list in his pocket. He gave us our gun back. He's not a bad- All these you. people that you think yeah, are bad guys thanks, are actually not as bad as you seriously. think they are. It's hard to take you characters seriously, but I want to. Good luck. Is he in before the storm? Is he like very different in that? Like, do you see him before he got messed up? Because his life is pretty messed up now. Is he different in- if, It'd be really cool if he was in the other one. I feel that like we did cool. everything Frank gave right. The code to help us. Rachel must have seen something oh, good. Oh, guys, in look at the whales. Do you know that when whales like like die, eventually they explode because all of the gases build up in their tummy. Kind of grim, right? The bad guys are morally great. Yeah, exactly. Like you know that something happened for him to get to that point, and not that he was just like born bad. Like people aren't just born bad, you know. Can I draw something on this? Oh, you guys said I could draw something on that. <laughs> okay. Let's head over. Will I get to do the party tonight? Like, in this episode? I don't know. He is in Before the Storm. Oh, I forgot. I didn't take a picture of the whale. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Ah, that sucks. Okay, this is all the evidence we got. Why? We've got this burner phone. But what evidence is the burner phone? Chloe, are you okay? I'm glad things worked out okay with Frank. It's nice to have one less enemy in Arcadia Bay. Amen to that. Okay, let's go ahead and 
look at our new evidence. Gather information on a character by selecting all the correct clues. For each section, there is a specific number of clues to collect. So this Thanks is to David's own investigation. I should be able to find out what Nathan did during the party's week. Okay. <gasps> okay, I don't know which one to go for. <laughs> uh, what, what am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do here? I'm so confused. Uh, uh, <laughs> got Nathan's picture. And his coordinates. And this. And that's all she wrote. Please let me find some clues about Nathan in here. Oh, we got a message from Frank. Hey, Max, just want to see how the search is going. Frank's Frank, we're getting closer. I see why Chloe digs you. Stop by, but stop by later if you both want a party. And good luck. Is he just offering his drugs there? I don't know. Was that the right clue? David's clues. Investigate. Great. Now, how do I find out which car is Nathan's to match the coordinates? Um. It was that one, right? Oh, man. Coordinates. Do I just pick random ones? <sighs> Fail. Abort. Wrong clue. Come on. Deduce Nathan's license plate number, then match it up with the coordinates. Oh, do I have to look at them? Oh, I was just trying to go in blind. Interesting. Is this Nathan's Twilight car? Zone. Twilight Zone, okay. Yep, another car David was tracking. Uh, okay. <sighs> Who else was David tracking? Oh, here? wait, it said what his plates were there. Hmm. Wait, that's a different one. Who does this one. car belong to? Of course Nathan drives an SUV. Overcompensating. Maybe I should have let Warren beat Nathan's ass down. Oh, man, this is hard. That's definitely Chloe's car. Ah, oh, so he, he that that some of these are Chloe's, so that's S X F F T. Why and the that hell one's are you the following these people? And to where? We know that this one is the car, right? I think. I don't know which one it is out of these two. There's Nathan dealing to the kids right out in the open. Oh man, this is more confusing. That's Chloe's car. That's the car. Is the wow, mum's car? This looks like an oh, expensive wait. machine. That's the dad's car. He's tracking that as well. He's tracking everything, but I want Nathan's. Okay, so I think that one's Nathan's. And I think that much is, was it this one? And then, what do I need now, a picture of Nathan? Nope. Maybe I should try to link other clues together. The tape on the tail light. But how does that help? There's no tape on that tail light. Oh, yes, tape on the tail light. Well done. Okay, so it's this car. Max, there's no logical uh, way. It's the SX one. S, it begins with an S. No, not that. So okay. I need to click that. Nathan's tail light is buff. That one. Yes. Now we're finally getting it. Thank somewhere. you. That's the car that hit Chloe. Chloe. <gasps> you let's are plug kidding. Let's in these numbers and see if they lead to an actual address. No aye, way, aye, Captain. Here we come, Rachel. Oh my gosh, if Rachel's actually alive. I don't think she is. I honestly, have, I don't expect that outcome. What's these clues? What now? Frank's clues. Mac, roger that. Let's look at Frank's drug deals during the week of the party. Okay. Where is his, is this his client list? Rot must stand for Rottweiler. That does fit Nathan. Oh, he names Rot. them all, what? He names them all after dogs. Who, Mr. F Miss Fancy Car is a bobtail. Who else we've got? Nathan's a Rottweiler. Chloe's a Bulldog. I don't know most of the other names on here, though. Le Logan is a Labrador. <laughs> okay, so we've got... Who is this account book? Frank's account book. The oh, okay. Encrypted. Well, we've got the encryption. It's this. Yes, the game Boom. is on. Now... Talk People don't post spoilers. Tell us everything. Okay, now investigate this. So we need to look for Rockweiler. Frank sure is keeping his customers Dash and Peg her, but, um, He could open a Peg store. Peg Labrador. Where is... Oops, I keep pressing the wrong stuff. Everybody in Arcadia Bay must be high. <laughs> if Frank applied this kind of detail okay. to his life... 
Hmm. Two Nine. deals with Nathan. Oh wait, it's awesome. Contact high just reading this. Two deals with Nathan. Rock there. Boondocks. And what about this one? I wonder what dog named Frank Rock Viler again. Me. Molly. Two sheets. Skeeto acid. Cocaine. What did he buy on this one? GB GHB? Oh man, I don't know what I'm too gormless when it comes to drugs, honestly. Okay, Max. Remember these names and Well it's got to be this how one. Fits in with all this. And this one, right? Is there more? Did he buy more and I've just missed it? Boxer, beagle. There. Those are three. Oh, yes. These are all the times Boom. and places for Frank and Nathan's deals. Oh, thank you, mods. Uh, that was Nari, thank you. Okay. Now what? I quite like doing the clues bit. I think this is really fun. I have to analyze Nathan's, Nathan's messages. messages. So I need to try and unlock his phone. What could happen? <sighs> There's a lot of numbers in here. Probably not that then. Holy shit. It's got to be this. Is seriously on 9535. But those numbers might be useful. 9535, we could try that one. This is the Vortex Club party where Nathan drugged Kate. Oh my gosh. If there is a <gasps> dark room, couldn't hurt to give this pin code a whack. Sim pin. Can I try? Do I only get three goes? I'm, I want to try this. It has to be that, right? I mean, what's this? Oh, so busted. It's good to see the Prescotts can't ah, cover all their distributed tracks. Distributed classes, they cannot tolerate, la la la. I think it's got to be that one. And... Oh, but I need something else. What's the other thing I need? A SIM card? Wait, a SIM card to get on the phone, right? Okay, no. <laughs> Not that. Maybe it's this? What, what else could it be? The, the, the flyer? Those clues are not related. Uh, this? Better look for any clues or numbers that could be his pen code. I mean, there's a lot of numbers in this. Okay, Max. Let's blow this code up and go home. Okay. This is fun, but it's tough. We've not done anything like this so far. Let's start hacking. Hack- okay, I, I think this has them. <sighs> Let's try 9535. 95... Three. Wow, why did I go the wrong way? Five. Oops. Bad code. Hmm. Okay. Maybe he never changed it. Make sure to change it, but maybe he never did. Let's just try one, one, one. Yeah, I knew it wouldn't be that easy. Okay. Would it be in his student file? Surely not. Work phone. Cell phone. GPA. There's way too many numbers there. Surely it's not one of those. Which means it's got to be something else on this paper. 4436-0058. Let me try those. 0058. You locked it, dumbass. Oh, I have to rewind. Okay, let's try again. <laughs> uh, oh! You got, I'm trying to like see if the chart can help me. Um, four, four, three, six. Let's try that one. Four, four, three, six. Yeah, I knew it wouldn't be that easy. Surely it's got to be something on this piece of paper. Can I not flip the paper? Five, four, three, one. Five, four, three, one. You locked it, dumbass. Ah! Asia Rose, 314, thank you so, so much for joining the Peach Squad. Okay. Let's start hacking. Is it in his student file? That's the only other place. Like, surely not. What could it be in here? Phone, 01987036363. Let's try 0198. <laughs> 0198. Oops. Ah! Okay, what was the other one? 7063. 7063. Yeah, I knew it wouldn't be that easy. 
I can't find him. Maybe he scribbled it. Oh, there's no other numbers on there. Wait, nine nine eight eight. Should I try that one? Nine nine eight eight. You locked it, dumbass. Ah! <laughs> Does anybody have any emotes that look like numbers? I can't figure it out, guys. I'm too stupid. 70063 appears twice on here, by the way. 7063. 1010. I can try that. <laughs> I'm watching your guys' emojis. 1010. Ah! We might have to turn on uh, chart just for a minute because I can't figure this out. And it's not on here. It's. Why can't it just- Oh, my headphones have run out of battery. Darcy, my not Bubba. Let me put my headphones on charge. It's fine, I have backup headphones. There's numbers on the card. SIM card. You guys are saying on the SIM card. Where? Google is the key. Wait, you guys are saying his birthday. Where does it say what his date of birth is? 29th, 1995. I don't see how that's helpful. 29th, 19... 29th of August. You guys do the month first, right? Yay! Thank you! Thank you, guys. I'm like, I don't see how it's helpful because I thought there was too many numbers, but you guys are totally right. What's up? Need the G. Okay, cool. You sold me water. Calm down. Bring it to me. Bringing it. Stay away, pigs on the beach. Yes. You home? Got to party tonight, home. On Ethan the way, load the ball. Ethan was jonesing hard the night of the Hey, party. I need to score ASAP. I don't he make house calls, you have a car. Drugs. No time, charge me double. Damn right, have cash on you, give me the address. I'll call and give you the exact directions. In transit, get that money Drug out. Dealer drama. You up, bro? What do you need? Peruvian flake, skidoo acid. Your pain night prices don't make me wait. Sorry, I need some more stuff. You home? Yes, don't come. So he did something to annoy him. On... The the sev wait the tenth of September no, the seventh of of October I don't know. Ah, hey, need weed You're now. Out of control. Calm yourself. You're tweaking. Soon, hook a brother up, please. Meet the beach. Be cool this time. So it was you. Keep your smart mouth shut about now everything, or a coming for your call ass. You a psycho stalker. Now I know where you sleep. Is this from Nathan's father? Please do not contact me at work. I've told it's you this brutal. before. I'm being high is not an excuse anymore. This is a business, not just a hobby. You want to treat you want me to treat me like an adult who can get things done, impress me. I've I'd I'd like nothing more than to be proud of you. I'm not there yet. Wow. Okay. Thank you guys for helping me. Jacob X Sims, thank you so so much for subscribing. So we know he was trying to score drugs on the night of the party. What are we investigating now? Oh Jacob my Wagner. gosh. What? Go through all this data and you can find out where Nathan took Kate after the party. Okay, so we need to try and what? Put them to what? What is this stuff? Oh! Okay, so the night of the party. I think it was this, where he's like, charge me double. That was a 10th four. American dates confuse me so much. 10 four. Well, that's 9 30. 10 7. 10 7. 10 four. I think it's that. Does that work? And flyer. Oh, wait! So, this infamous party. Yeah, yeah, it was the 10th of the 4th. Okay. I actually got that right just by the text. I'm kind of having myself there. At the junkyard? Ten, we need 10 4 that again. Beach is like Frank's main office. I know Nathan wasn't looking for. No doubt that Nathan stays in his 10 4, room. 10 4. So, he could be hiding clues there too. Oh, you're treading water, Otter. Okay. Somebody is stocking up on gas. Not much out there. 10-4. Is it that? If I can no. match one of the tech... Oh, that has to be the Prescott estate. 10-4, it's there. Poor rich Nathan. This no. makes no sense. <laughs> if Joyce knew what Nathan did to Chloe, she would fry his ass. I'm nope. sure the top two are right. Maybe Wait, I no! try to... Uh, I went backwards by accident. That one's got to be the right one, right? 
On the way, load the bowl. Oh, is it that one? 10-4. I feel like it's those, it's that one. Unless there's another one of these. Unless I'm being dumb again. Wait, what was that? I'm gonna go for that one too. Wait, how much did he pay there? 250 quid. Okay, and then was it this one? Since no. Kate left the party early with Nathan. There we go. I should search for texts. Chloe. This is I got the wrong drug because I don't know enough about drugs. Ah, I didn't know enough about drugs. Stop doing that emote, char. You're nope. all like... Nothing, Max. There's nothing here. There's some shitty old barn. Let's keep searching and find out who owns this haunted Thank barn. Thank you for the posture check. I'm on this. Hold on. Somebody named Harry Aaron Prescott. Prescott, is that the I'm dog? shocked. Should we call the police? Fuck that. You know the police here are like Nathan's private security, right? I got there in the That's end. It's so messed up. Mm -hmm. As you've noticed, this whole town is messed up. We can't trust anybody. Except each other. So we have to go out to that farmhouse by ourselves. Oh my gosh. I was afraid you'd say that. We could call I guess we're not going go away. Kicked Nathan's ass. It's just the two of us, nobody else. And I'm not scared at all. You have the power. Stop relying on my power. I this close to Makes me Rachel. nervous. Makes me we anxious. Have to find her, Max. We will. But remember, my power isn't infinite. We still have to be careful. She does not want Warren Do coming along for the ride, me? does she? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. She's speaking like a step douche. <laughs> Okay, guys, I feel like some things, I, I'm, I'm nervous about this moment. I feel like something serious is gonna go down. I just hope I've made the right choices. No trespassing. We are trespassing. This is the barn. Okay. Holy it, shit, this is scary. This looks like oh. the barn from- um, oh, Let's go find the best way in. Oh, what is the name of the show where they're all in a biker gang? It ended really traumatically. But it looks like the barn from that. <laughs> Whoa, check this out. Fresh tire tracks. Dude, somebody was just here. <gasps> and they've locked it. Then we need to get in that barn. Sons of Anarchy! There's a, there's a barn that looks like this in Sons of Anarchy. Okay, she's gonna try that way. We should go. <gasps> a squig! Hi, little Squig! Squiggle! Watson, we can safely assume that this ancient vehicle is not our suspect. Okay, can we get around the side? Hi, little Burb! Can we take a picture of it? Oh. Oh, wait! If oh, I just managed to get that. Technically, it flew off. We also got a text from Warren. Let's see what he said. Wow. I mean, we beat you, so whatever. Dad. I'm just, it's almost over. I'll call you guys. I love you. Okay, Warren. Thanks for leaving your mark on my door. I'll never erase it. You better not. It's permanent. Okay. Thanks, it wasn't it? Your wise grasshopper. Is that from before? Oh, this is from now. Okay, so are we still going to go? I can't work out if we're going to the drive-in or not. I need to schedule my evening. Okay, game, please make it more clear. I can't tell what's going on. Am I going on a date or am I not? Because honestly, I'm kind of more into Chloe at this point, so... Chloe, I found the front door. Come I on. I kind of don't want to go on a date with Warren and lead him on. That is kind of what I'm thinking. Oh, yes. Maximus rules. She's mellowed out so much. God, she's she's so much easier to hang out with now. I have goosebumps all over. Come on, Supermax. Hey, check out this old chest. Oh my gosh, please don't be a body in it. Please don't be a body in it. Please don't be a body a in it. Louder, Chloe. Jeez, that is ancient. Jackpot. Old shit. No, look closer. Harry, Aaron, Prescott, and family donate new library to Arcadia Bay. Prescott Industries celebrate grand opening. Um, I'm scared Prescott's of him being here. Bomb shelter boom to town. Nice scrapbook. You search for more clues and I'll scope out the area. Okay. 
It's real creepy inside this barn. We got yes. a tractor. Oh, this tractor has paid its dues. We've got... We've got some pictures and stuff here. Even Harry Aaron Prescott was into selfies. So this must be the grandfather, right? Like a generation ago? And he was buying bomb shelters for the town? Is that what he said? We've got some trucks in here. Okay, there's no reason for anybody to drive out here. But there must be... And a crate? I guess the Prescotts oh, were just wow. born bastards. I cannot read that right in. Uh, 1903. Dear Mr. Dear Mr. Linden, I'm writing in regards to your outstanding debts that you've chosen to ignore. The Prescotts may not be established business gentlemen, but we are businessmen and expect our due. We take your silence as a personal insult and thus dedicate our family name to making you pay your debt with 10% interest plus a written apology. These conditions are not met by the end of the day, t July 24th, in the year of our Lord, 1903. Rest assured, we'll make your lives living hell. Okay, so they've been jerks for over 100 years. So you know what? At least they're consistent. Like, you can't knock that. You can't knock that. Wow, sir. Talk wow. about home on the range. So this is the way the barn used to look. It does not look like that anymore. There's no way this rusty-ass button will activate these ropes or pulleys. Okay, should we try anyway? No, okay. <laughs> Ring. Ring. Melody the honeybee! Hello again! Thank you so much for being here for two months! You have such a cute username. Why did I just get- Ooh, ground. We just walked on something? <sighs> Nothing here. Is anyone really scared we're gonna find Rachel's body? Because I'm really scared we're gonna find Rachel's body. If a zombie shows up, I have my weapon. There's a door or something under me, right? Just rotting wood. Oh my gosh. Be careful. Nothing. Was there nothing there? Wait, what's that? I can't tell. This whole place is making me really nervous. A hook. Huh. These hooks are used to lift haystacks. I saw them in a Friday the 13th movie. And a crate up here? Ah, oh, the good old days. Eggs, bacon. 14 cents for eggs, but 60 cents for milks. Milks! Does that say cocaine? You could get co cocaine for two, two dollars. Okay. <laughs> Ooh, more ground to search. I'm a bit nervous. This is making me a little bit nervous. I don't really want to uncover something horrible. Ooh, I think we've uncovered something. No more secrets, Sean Prescott. Whoa. Okay. What is this? There's something hidden under here. It's totally brand new. I'm just gonna make sure I didn't Why? miss anything else. Because there's a haystack here. So many haystacks. So, so few, few needles. needles. Okay. <laughs> it was a corny line. That's what it was. A padlock. Can't we use the pitchfork? And no, super max. Get you it open. You can't open this with your bare hands. Use a pitchfork. Let's go back the perimeter, Max. There has to be more here than this crate. Can we okay, Chloe. Um, I, I found some kind of hatch, but it's locked. Use the pitchfork. I got this. I hope. Let me know the Pretty sure this old pitchfork oh. will open a padlock. Try again, Max. Can I, like, press this? Nope. Okay. What about the hook? Can I release the hook to smash through? Ooh! Okay. And then, should I try and press that button? She doesn't think it's gonna work, though. But I'll try it. No. Okay. There's no way this rusty-ass button will activate these ropes or pulleys. How do we do it, then? Wait, can I move? What, what is it attached to? Where is it going? Who am I? What's going on? Where are you looking? Can I get upstairs somehow? There's like a platform up there. Boring. Climb. Chloe, can you give me a hand? Sidekick at your service. Okay, what are we gonna find? Please don't find like I'm loads of girls. Away, like, Super Max. Oh, I please don't find something like that. Like, The Last of Us, we had enough like, you know, Stuff like that going on. I don't want to see more of it. What is that? What have we just pulled down? Or is this our way to get up? That looks sturdy enough to stand on. Okay. <gasps> Please don't fall to your death here, Max. Be careful. Be careful, Maximus. 
rope. Do okay. not fall. I'm just gonna make sure there's nothing else to see up here. It's super windy. Ooh, look. What is it? Not the time has Oh, is it a tweet? Woo! Woohoo! A little owling. Owl looks like honestly quite pissed at us, not gonna lie. <laughs> I think it might fly over and attack us, so let's do this. Nope. I can't pull this rope without tearing my flesh off. I need to hook this up to something heavier. Tell me if you need any help. I need help. Uh, Chloe, I need help. <gasps> Chloe, help. <laughs> Old motor. Wait, it's a motor. That looks sturdy enough to stand on. But can't I use the motor? What can I use it? I don't know what to bring. Do I bring the pitchfork? Can I use the pitchfork now? Shall I see if she'll grab it? No. Pretty sure this old pitchfork won't open a padlock. Chloe, help. I can't figure it out again, on my own. Max. Chloe, help me. Chloe won't help. Okay, great. Uh, Can I use an old tractor? Ah! Owl! Can the owl help me? Climb up to the top, rewind to- Oh, yes! Thank you, thank you, thank you! That makes so much more sense. Also, we got a hype train! We got a hype train! Woohoo! Okay, rewind time. But wait, wait, wait! I have to be at the top, I have to be at the top. Okay, I have to be at the top first. Thank you. I still- I've never really got the- the hang of the whole, you know, Using uh, the rewind, have I? There we go. Okay. So, I can attach it to this. Nice! Thank you, guys. Thank you, guys. Marilyn8, thank you so, so much for subscribing. Sassy Soda. Climb up to the top, rewind. Time. Yep, thank you. Grim Gubby, thank you so, so much for the pride so bits. That didn't work at all. What? What? Why? Why does that not work? Hmm. Rope attach. Oh, did I not attach it before? Maybe I just never attached it. LOL. Okay, let's try now. Oops. <laughs> Sassy Soda, thank you so, so much for the advice. Grim Gabby, thank you so much for the pride bits. Esk Rhea, thank you so, so much for uh, gifting a sub. Thank you for gifting a sub. Did that work? Max Giver strikes again. Yeah! Drive Shaft, thank you so, so much for being here for two months. That's awesome. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And Lucio Sims, thank you so, so, so much for showing your love with the bits as well. Appreciate that. Okay. Now we should be able to get it. Wait. Should I rewind time so that no one knows I've done this? I don't know. Damn, this is heavy. Good job, we got a team member. Thank you guys for triggering what the hype train. Is this? Oh, guys, I'm really nervous Jackpot. about this. What are Do they I doing? Do I even need to say how weird this is? Do they like? It? Who built this kind of place? Oh gosh, a press guys. Guy, of course. What is going on here? What is going on here? What is going on here? I feel like this is just taking a super dark turn. Oh gosh. I'm really worried that they're like doing something to the girls. This it sounds different is so down here. Surreal. There's a keypad. How am I gonna know what the code is though? This is too heavy to break. So I'll need a code. Oh gosh, not a code again. Marissa! Marissa Janille, thank you so much so much for subscribing at tier two! You can use the Lilith emo. Please go wild with it. Okay, how am I supposed to know what the code is? Oh! I can see where they've pressed. I can see where they've pressed. So someone's pressed on five. Oh, you guys completed a train level. Hey Lexi Lubrush. Five. Let's go five, two, four. Okay. Wrong code. Five, four, two. No way! Oh, okay, yes. that could have taken a really long time. I that only worked in the movies. Hey! Uh, Lou brush. Hey, Papa. Hey, pretty baby. Open sesame. Open sesame. Oh, God. I don't know. <gasps> Guys, I'm worried about what we're about to find here. 
I feel like Chloe could have ended Stop up here. Stop ready for the apocalypse. This must have cost a fortune. <gasps> Unless they're triggering the apocalypse and this is their safe room. This is their like, you know, little doomsday bunker. Cause look, they got food. More survivalist supplies. Oh, cereals look yummy. Ooh, love a good bit of cereal. I miss cereal because I never supplies. eat breakfast. Kathy, all day. Thank David's you so much for saying love. Bunker. Oh, you shared the code, but I figured it out, so we all good. Oh no, no, Miss Chirura. I know Miss Chira is here again. Thank you so, so much. Thank you for using your bits. Thank you for popping in and saying hi. See you a few times now. David must shop at the same store. What's wrong, Baba? Do you guys want to see Lexi? She wants to see you. Come here, Baba. Ah, I'm trapped by my headphones. chilling in this room. The little brush is here. A baby. A baby has appeared. Hello. And another baby is here behind us. La Bopoli Boo, hello! Hello, Baba. I'll get you a chew in a minute, okay? We've got to finish this because something creepy is going down. We have to know what it is. We have to know what it is. I even remember to give you guys the game back. I usually forget that. Whoa. This says it all about. Whoa. Let's have a look. This says it As all Nathan's about primary Nathan. psychiatrist over five years, I feel like Can I should stop help. seeing your son. As you have disregarded my rather dire and immediate suggestions for his and others' well-being. You know the extent of Nathan's challenges, but I feel like you refuse to acknowledge the role you play in his mental health. If I do not have your support, I cannot treat Nathan. It is as simple as that. Uh, I fear he's becoming even more disconnected from reality, even if he acts in a personable manner. You have ignored my request for consultation with you and your wife, so I have, I have assumed you are no longer interested in my services. Regardless, I care about Nathan, and I believe he needs serious help. If you would like to talk about this matter, I'm always available. So Nathan is seriously messed up. Like, sorry, Darcy, Baba, I'm gonna have to move these this side because they're on your head. There you go. Nathan is seriously, seriously messed up. Five years that guy has been, and, but his dad isn't helping him. Talk Why is that tape? tape? Bunker is always a bad sign. Oh, guys, I'm really worried about where this is going. Anonymous Cheer is cheered again. Thank you so, so much. Thank you so much, Anonymous Cheer. Also, Lucio Sims. Thank you, thank you, thank you for showing some love as well. Guys, is this about to get really messed up and dark? Why is there a, f a printer? I guess Nathan needs the most expensive printer in the world. Has Nathan just built this bunker or is it his... D <gasps> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Oh, I've got chills down my spine. Oh, guys, what's going on? <sighs> that son of a bitch. Stormbreaker bunker. 1.3 million? Sean Prescott. So is that the is that his dad? His dad commissioned this. Talk about tortured. Is Nathan bringing women down here to torture? What has this got to do with the tornado? I don't understand. I don't understand everything. Unless it's like different stories. Oh my gosh, these are files with women's names on them. Why is it always women? Why are people always doing this to women? Like seriously. Come on, let's see what this shit is all about. We is are. there a Rachel file? There is. Okay. A binder marked Victoria, but it's empty. Look, the next one says Kate. Oh no, Kate. <gasps> no. He Gosh, brought her here. That bastard back there. He brought her here. wasn't the first. All those binders are filled with other victims. What was he, what, what was he doing to them? <sighs> Victoria has to be next. Nathan must be planning to dose her tonight at the Vortex Club party. Rachel. What, Rachel? <gasps> this can't be real. These are all, these are all post shots, right? Right? Chloe, look at her face. She's out of it. Maybe, maybe Nathan paid her a shitload of cash to do this. She probably would have. I don't oh, think so. Her. Why is he putting her in the ground like that? Where? The junkyard. Max, we have to find that spot now. Then, then we can see what he did. There's no way she's dead. No way. She posed for those pictures, Max. I oh, know it. Guys. Please, let's go. Oh, guys. I feel like we're going to find Rachel's body. We're going to find Rachel's body. Thank you guys for doing the hype train. Oh, my God. We got level two Rachel. support. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Kate, all these files. This picture is framed different. <gasps> oh, my gosh. Rachel is awake her. fucking furious. Rachel has passed out. And she has something in her mouth. What happened to her? 
This shot is so staged. I, I, I can't believe it. Who is that other person? I can't. Who's the other person with her? Wait, is that Nathan? Were they passed out together? I don't understand what's going on. We need to take a picture of them. The one time she's got a camera on her and she doesn't use it for Kate good. She looks so doped up. She has no idea she's being posed. At least Kate was asleep through all this bullshit. Jeez. What's this letter? I can't look at the net letter. Oh, there's a note here. Whoa. What is going on between Nathan and Nathan, his father? Nathan, I told you never to call me using your phone. Stick with the disposable ones I gave you. I don't hear you screaming out my name in a public place, which you've stupidly done before. I haven't set all this up and shared my vast wisdom, so you can mess it up with your teen rage. We had accomplished a lot together, but you have to let me guide you. Or you Their dad does this too? Does the dad do this as well? Let's see what's in here. <gasps> that's Kate. Oh my god. That's, that's no. Lightroom. He's like developing the pictures. Do they sell them? Do they sell them? Like, what is going on? What is going on? This is so messed up. Is this the same cupboard as before? Ah, oh, the Apocalypse Entertainment System. Oh my gosh. I wish I'd let Warren beat the hell out of him. I've never seen so much pricey equipment before. This is where they take the photos. Can we not mess up his stuff? So who's using this fancy tripod? This, oh, thank you for the hydrate. This is so messed up. This is so messed up. I did not realize that it was like this. This must be the crap that Nathan gets from Frank. Needles. Needles? Gross. The, oh my gosh, I did not realize it was gonna take this turn. Oh, guys, I'm so glad I put the trigger warning up. I hope you guys have taken heed. Somebody likes their whiskey. Somebody likes their whiskey. No, I was trying to look at the paper. These newspapers are all about Rachel and Kate. Jeez. What did he do to Rachel? Maybe after this, she just ran away. Please say she just ran away. Please say she just ran away. Please, 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 please. Posture check, thank you. Oh my gosh. Why? She takes photos of a squirrel and a bird. She doesn't take photos of the evidence of what the Prescotts have done. Why? Why? You guys can hear Ali upstairs. He's talking to the dogs. I think he's talking to Lexi. Yeah, why did she not take any pet photos then? Chloe, slow down! Wait for me! Oh, I know exactly no. where I'm going! Oh, well, sorry. I'm gonna, like... I need to switch the music off. <gasps> I can't switch the music off. I might have to re-edit this one because this sounds like official music. But I feel like she's about to find something here. Look, this is it! This is it! Oh, gosh. Are you gonna help me, Max? Oh god, oh Chloe, god. stop! D Look. Surely you can't just dig with your own- No. Please, no. Oh no. Oh! oh. That smell! Rachel! Oh. No, Rachel, oh, no, 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 please, no! <laughs> oh my gosh, oh my Chloe. gosh. It was Rachel. I said- <laughs> I said it. I knew she was going to be dead. Rachel, what? I'm sorry, Chloe. Oh my I'm gosh. I'm so sorry. I loved her Jeez. so much. How can she be dead? What? Did Nathan do it? Or did Dad do it? I feel like they're both really messed up. Who does this? Oh my gosh. As if she knew the exact right spot as well. Oh my gosh. Oh. Jeez, this game is so dark. This is so much darker than I was expecting it to be. I really thought we might find Rachel. Surely if you guys say that she's in before the storm and you get to know her in that as well, it's like, oh look, the deer. The deer is watching them. Does the deer represent Rachel? Does the deer represent Rachel Amber? Oh, oh jeez. 
I thought we might end up finding a body, guys. I really thought that would be the case. But then I thought maybe she might just run away as well. Oh my gosh. He's gonna do it to Victoria tonight. Is this going to turn into we have to save Victoria? I hope Nathan enjoys his last party. Chloe, we can go right to the cops. We have proof. Fuck the police. Rachel wanted us to find her. So we could get real justice. And revenge. The Prescotts have had this coming for a hundred years. Oh, and nobody is going to get in my way. Especially with your help. Right? I'm with you to the end, Chloe. You know that. It kind of feels, you know, like Chloe's the main character. Max is like the you control her, but she's not really the main character. She didn't know Rachel. She doesn't have this, like, vendetta against the press courts. It's kind of like Chloe's story, really, isn't it? Oh, shit. This is like that eclipse. You're right. Look at the outline. I can't tell if they're different. What is there that? Can't be too much. Jesus, Chloe, look up at the sky. What the hell? Beautiful. I don't give a shit. The world is ending. Cool. You're not listening. Why is there two Something moons? Something major is going is down. Is there two? That's right. Nathan Prescott is going. Is there down. two timelines colliding here, or like two universes colliding? The one before, the one that we've seen. Where? Welcome to the end of the world, ladies. I'm glad you decided to escort me. Are these the me. two universes you colliding? Really good, Warren. The two timelines. Right after today. I'm glad you stopped me. He's drunk. Nathan is dangerous. Where is he? I didn't see him at the dorm again. I was held up in my room. Dude, have you been drinking? Well, if you consider half a beer drinking... Is he true enough to half a Let's beer? Let's go, Max. Hey, hey. I know this is a bad time, but can I get one picture? I've been feeling like this might be actually the end of the world, so... I want to have something for prosperity. Well, I don't blame you, Warren. I know, I know. I'm a pain in the booty. Just one picture. Oh my gosh, drunk people uh, are so annoying when you're sober. Action. So annoying. We've got no time for this shit. Come on, Max. I Sorry. feel like I just the, wanted to feel the like timeline where Zoe, um, Chloe, is a, a quadriplegic. Quad I was always the one getting my ass kicked. And this timeline, I'm combining. We That's why there's two moons. Help. If you see Nathan, text me immediately, okay? And do not let him see you. You won't. I know how to be invisible here. Not to me, Warren. Text soon. <sighs> Why? That looks so boring. Just like drinking by yourself in the dark. Like what? Is the tornado the result of two timelines colliding? I don't know. I'm just spitballing here. Hi. Can I take your coat or anything? No. I didn't see any tablet with cat pics. Okay, so is this us trying okay, to get Chloe, in? Where the hell are you? Wait, is Chloe run off ahead? Ugh, I hate touching all these clothes. It is kind of nasty. Plus, Stella. some of the Vortex Club always give me attitude. Stop. Uh, hi, Stella. Hey, Max. Welcome to the end of the world. Do you want me to check anything in? Uh, no thanks, Stella. Have you seen Nathan yet? Her voice no, sounds so weird God. there. That boy creeps me out. Wait, some girl just asked about Nathan before you came in. Nathan's creepy. It's gonna be Chloe, we know Why that. Why does Nathan creep you out? He should, I, I just want your reasons. He's a bully for one thing and he hit Warren for another. But have you ever looked at his eyes? Glazed and raging. Me no like. So why are you working at a Vortex Club party? I didn't think you wanted to be a member. Screw that, I'm here for the job. Who hired you? Who hired you? Mr. Jefferson asked me because he knows I don't have a lot of money, even with my job and scholarship. I'm not cool enough for this school. 
Yes, you are, Stella. You're smart. Not honest, the time to do your you usual your big up, everyone. Blackwell. We need to find Nathan I hope and Victoria. Everything turns out your way in the end. Huh? Oh, thank you, Max. I really appreciate that. Hey, your face looks so intense. Are you okay? Uh, no, I'm actually not okay. I, I just need to find Nathan. And don't get too close if you see him. Hell no. This is homework, not a party. I'll text you if I spy him. Good luck. Okay, we got people looking out for us, like to try and find him, which is good. Can I just go straight in? Okay, I'm just gonna head in. Hopefully she's gonna text us. Gosh. Oh, what? It's. Where, where is this party? How are they able to have a party in a pool? Like, what? Surely you can't mix students and drinking on pools. This is really messed up. Oh my gosh. Where is Victoria? Jeez, I'm not even at this party and it's giving me anxiety. We need to find Nathan and take him down. Oh yes, I'm a multi uh, let's see if these guys have seen him. Yes, Max Briggs in entrance. <laughs> I only came to the party because of you. I'm glad to see you out and about. By the way, have you seen Nathan Prescott tonight? No, I've been hanging with Brooke since I got here. Max, are you okay? Your face looks so serious. <laughs> um, uh, I know. I'm, I'm not in party mode tonight. You look like you're on a secret mission. This is where it's going to end, for Rachel's sake. What? Oh, That's such Max, a random thing to come up with. Break. I'm taking Brooke to a Miyazaki show in Portland. If you want to come along, the more the merrier. Thanks, Daniel. I have to stay on my mission now. Am I just gonna have I to ask everybody that they might have seen him? Well, well, we're like talking to everybody like we're never gonna see them again. Adios. Have you noticed? Is she Hello, still mad at us? Max, I didn't expect to see you at a Vortex Club party. I didn't expect that either, but I really need to find Nathan. Have you? No, I haven't seen him. And I'm not looking for him, so I most likely won't tonight. She's so I mean to us. And his club. Why are you here then? Not the only one. Why are you here? So, why are you here tonight? No homework? Boredom? Waiting? Have you seen Warren tonight? No, I was talking to Daniel. He asked me to go with him to the Portland Art Museum this weekend. Oh, um, that, that's so sweet. This is the- like, I we're wasting time! Just go! I'm more Just into go. science than art, but what kind of a selfish fangirl would miss a Miyazaki exhibition? You're not selfish, Brooke. You're just trying to live your life without all this bullshit. Like all of us here. You seem so wise and kind of invincible this week. I think that snow and eclipse gave you superpowers. Check to see if you can fly. Double moon, ooh. Only with your drone. By the way, did you see that crazy double moon out there earlier? Max, if I saw a double moon out there, I would assume it really was the end of the world. Go look, well, then! The night is still young, Brooke. And so are we, Max. So let's plan a drone date next week. There won't be a next week. No one but seems okay. to know where Nathan is. See, energy drinks, soda, energy drinks. I know somebody has the booze. There's Courtney drinking alone, without Taylor or Victoria. Oh my I wonder gosh. why. The, like, alcohol, these strobe lights, and- Oh my gosh! No! Please! Something always happens to her. I will- I refuse to let it happen again. Warn. Alyssa, incoming! I'm on it. <laughs> of course you stepped up to protect me from another humiliating moment. Thank you, Max. Her- we- she only exists so that we can try and save her. I'm surprised to see you here. Nathan. Alyssa, I have to find Nathan. Have you seen him? I really don't know, but surely in the VIP section, like it's a New York club. Uh. Thanks, Alyssa. Watch out for yourself. Why, when I have Max Caulfield at my side? Good luck. 
Okay, she was useful, so we need to try and find VIP. This is VIP. Obviously, he'd be here, and obviously, there's bouncers on the door. Uh, okay. Excuse me, but I'm going in. Sorry, but this is the VIP section. Members only. Why even okay? have VIP Sorry, at like I'm a... I'm on the list, okay? Like a stupid I know that pool Max party. Caulfield is not on any list for the Vortex Club. Nice try. Listen. No, you listen. Courtney is supposed to be the VIP gatekeeper, not me. So please go. Okay. Well, that I way is not going to work. need to find a way to enter this bullshit club. What about if we go through the changing rooms? Okay. Hey, wow. Max. What are you doing? Oh my gosh. Who's that? Who's that? If I get sick now, I can drink more later. Oh my gosh. Yo, maximum overdrive about This just time. like me like God, these pies look so lame. lame. <laughs> you want to get ripped? No. Uh you look pretty ripped already, Justin. And not happy. Why did you even come tonight? Where else could I go in Arcadia Bay on a Thursday night? Besides, Dana is here. Just not with me. So yes, this party sucks. Da Rachel? Did he know Rachel? Rachel Amber won't be coming either. Damn, I was thinking about Rachel and Chloe tonight. If they showed up together right now, shit would end. Oh. Rachel could always shut Victoria down. Good for Rachel. I wish I could have seen that. Max, I know I'm twisted, but your face looks so fucking intense. And your voice sounds different. You okay? No, we don't dad? have time for this. Uh, no, I'm, I'm cool, Justin. And I have to get going. Maybe you should go chill somewhere else. Fucking A, Maximus. You're right. I'm only torturing myself here. Plus, I'm too loaded. It's time to get my board and grind. No, I don't think that's a good idea. I really don't think that's a good idea. Exit the Vortex Club. Okay. Poster. Someone on the floor. Somebody peeing. People queuing for the toilet. A bra. Ugh, gross. How did this even get here? Somebody's either having sex or throwing up. Or both. Oh my gosh, someone's been sick there. Good night, sweet prince. Kill the Prescotts. Chloe must be around. What? Why have we bro what, lost Chloe this quickly? Where am I supposed to go? I thought using the bathroom I'd be able to get around the back, but I don't think I can. I don't know where to go. I'd like to tear every one of these things down. Okay, there was nothing of use in here. Great. Supermax lives. Not anymore. Oh, that's because I saved thingy, isn't it? Can't I just swim around? Just jump in and swim around. Just jump in the water, go. Why can't I just get in and swim there? I'm so not impressed by this VIP crap. A banner, I don't know how to get in. Yes, you do so. Ah! Can I get around the other side, maybe? If I run all the way around? Let me see if I can get around. I've honestly, she should just swim there. She'd be the only sober one in the water. Go talk to Courtney. Where is she? Can you guys see her? That was Alaria. Alaria says go talk to Courtney and also Lua100049494. Uh, Thank you so, so much for subscribing. But where is Courtney? Why can't I see her? It's not her. Alyssa. Was Courtney in the queue? Oh what, my gosh. These lights are just annoying me. Was she in here? Let me see. If she, are you guys think she's in here? I might need the chart for help. I might, we, we might need to bring chart back up again. Neither of these two are Courtney, hey, though. Max. What are you doing? Justin, in here? no, no one here is Courtney. If I get sick now, I can drink more later. Where are you, Courtney? Courtney was supposed to be on VIP. Not helpful. 
Courtney is alone at the bar. Tiffany Lynn, 4 4, thank you so, so much. Oh, okay. We couldn't talk to her before. Maybe we can now. Hey, okay. Courtney, how are you? Max, our guest star arrives fashionably late. <laughs> Say bonsoir to the end of the world. Thank you, guys. Even though you flaked on my party makeover, you still get special access to the Vortex Club VIP lounge. You better let your minion know since she won't let me pass. Oh, that little asshole just made her last mistake. <laughs> she thinks she's Victoria. <laughs> bye bye <laughs> Now, let's go make an official VIP entrance, Max Factor. <laughs> get it? She's like, no, but okay. <laughs> hey, Sarah, um, do you know that I personally put Max's name on the list? So you like decide to block her from coming in while I'm taking a break? <laughs> you're not in charge here. Guessing. Wait, I, I just, uh, oh my God, you're done. And you're off the list permanently. Welcome to the Vortex Club. What is so cool about VIP? I don't know. Oh, she looks absolutely devoured. Okay, you gotta let us in now. What is the point in this area? It's so lame. It's so lame. Hayden is the Vortex Club. So his ass has to be here tonight. Hayden is a bomb. Kate. Thank you so much for coming by, Mark. You lifted my heart. It's so happy to see you smile again. You mean so much to me and many others. I have to go, but I want to say have fun at the movies with Warren. It's so sweet you bought me by some school books. Give him a hug from me. I will call him as soon as you need. He's sweet, but he's also very drunk right now. What's up, Hayden? Oh, look. Up in the sky, it's Super Max here to save the party. Have you seen Nathan? I just vaped some oh, dank OG buds. Gosh. Oh, I can barely see you. Or are these hotties next to me? You want to Wow. No, no, thank you. No. I want to find Nathan. Me too. He's supposed to be bringing some. How annoying are like party people that are drunk or drugged when you're not? <laughs> but like, at the party, everyone's been very annoying at this party so party far. At the party. Not this week. So has anybody here seen Nathan? I guess you have to go ask everybody here, or you can sit down and take a quick hit. No thanks, lame. Where's Victoria? What about? Victoria. Yeah, go ask her yourself. I would, but like I said, I'm fucking ripped. Oh, we need to walk Maybe away from this guy. Maybe you better take it easy tonight. Whatever. I'm in this world to have fun. Try it sometime, Max. I finally get you and Dana to come out to a Vortex Club party, but you just want to lecture me? Gee, thanks, Mr. Madsen. How much fun did Kate have at your last party? Listen, Hayden. Just watch out for Nathan tonight. I think that's your job, Max. Come back when you're ready to have fun. This guy's so lame. Annoying. A bomb. Give me a break. Okay. Oh! Oh my gosh, Darcy, no! Darcy, why would you turn on <laughs> Darcy just switched off my PlayStation. Darcy! Yeah. Why did you do that, Papa? Go down there, beautiful. Oh my gosh. I can't believe you just did that. Please say it saved where we were. Darcy! Oh my god. <laughs> yep, Darcy has definitely just switched off my PlayStation. Are you switching back on? Oh, it was kind of getting intense anyway. Maybe we can have a little, a little one minute refresher. There's no hype train though. Please ignore that. It's Helen who lies. There is no hype train. I think he switched it fully off. Like he fully lent on it because my PlayStation logo never comes up. I just let it sleep. What has he just done? Darcy, I swear to God. I swear to God. Look at all the fluff I got off him as well. So much fluff. It's just stuck on the PlayStation logo. I am worried. I am really worried. How often does it auto save? <laughs> oh, please say you've remembered where we were. Or else I have to go through it all again. Analyze said pet check. I mean, we just got one from Darcy, but there is a bean right there. She's sleeping though. She's having herself a little baby sleep. Oh my gosh, I can't believe he just did that. <laughs> Michaela Havel, thank you also for using your bits to let me know they're at the bar. I'm booting my PlayStation back up again. 
I can't actually believe you just did that. What a pure bra. What a pure bra! Oh my gosh. I don't know if it's saved. Come on. If I have to do all of this chapter again, I'm going to cry. I'm actually just going to cry. Don't do this to me, game. Don't do this to me. Hopefully we're still in VIP and I'm not, sw I'm not talking to that annoying dude again. That's just not going to happen. He's way too annoying. And he takes too much time talking. Okay, crush your fingers. Okay! This is good, we're back in VIP. We're back in VIP, we're not talking to him. Also, I just realized I need to switch this right down because I keep getting copyright strikes, so I just can't. This is the Vortex Club. Okay, so Taylor, Taylor's here. Max, look at you go, girl. Taylor, have you seen Nathan yet? Look at everyone's no, eyes. that's fine by me. He's been getting like too buggy and kind of scary. Oh gosh. Victoria might know. Where is Victoria? What does Victoria say about that? She blows it off, but Vic is close with Nathan. They're more like brother-sister. No. Or something. She really cares about him. Is this why you want to be in the Vortex Club? No, Max. I'm like far from home at a great school. I want to learn things, make friends, and party. But when Kate was on the roof, I knew I'd gone too far. Kate was dosed. Kate was dosed at the last Vortex Club party by Nathan. So, you should avoid any drink here tonight. Trust me, I won't even drink my own water when Nathan is around now. He's a pharmacy simulator. I do have to go now. Look out for yourself, Taylor. And give my best to your mom. Oh my gosh, this feels oh, very deep. Like, thanks, we're saying Max. goodbye to everybody. She's doing great after her surgery. I'm glad to know you're looking out for us, too. Kate. Oh, we've seen these messages. We've seen that. Okay. <laughs> Oxygen kit. That oxygen kit might come in handy if somebody binges. Barman, food. I think is very I know Victoria. Victoria is next on Nathan's hit list. Yes. Your picture's so. Sorry, Max. Vortex Club members only. Sorry, I'm on the guest list. I'm taking you off. Go fuck yourself, me, Victoria. I don't have time for this bullshit. Real cute, Max. And after I apologized to you the other day. Do you even have a clue what's going on at Blackwell? She's not going to listen to Kate us. Marsh tried to kill herself in front of you. And me. Everybody here. That's not my fault, Max. Don't you even try to blame me. They don't blame Nathan. I blame Nathan for dosing Kate, but nobody at that party even cared she was so wasted. It's a fucking party. Everybody is wasted. What do you want from me? Some humanity, Victoria. I'm the only person here who cares what Nathan is going through. I'm not the only problem child at Blackwell. This is bigger than a problem child. I'm not perfect, okay? I'm a teenager at an art school. I'm only here to become a photographer and get famous. Jefferson, you have talent or you suck. Maybe we should try and like make her listen. We should be talent, nice to her. Victoria. You don't have to push people out of your way. You don't understand. My parents own a gallery. I know how this art game has to be played. It's brutal. No, it's art. You don't have to play their way. Look at me. I got the judge of the contest suspended. On point, Max. Thanks for admitting again that I have some talent. Not that I think I always do. I don't either, but that's the choice you make. Hard to believe. But I don't always make the best choice. Can we just warn him already? Do you think it's, it's like, like stressing we're not me out? Be friends? Why not? No need. Why the hell not? We're both into art and photography. We're both kind of weird and pretentious. If we hung out with our attitude, we'd get along fine. I almost asked you to hang out. You said my photos were Avedon esque. Then I remembered who I was. You should have asked me. It would have been cool to compare photo notes. Maybe we're too much alike. You might be right. Well, Max Caulfield, there's still time for you to get Why are we not just warning part. her? What are we doing? I actually hope so, Victoria. Why do you say it like that? The dark room, don't want. Of course, Warner! Victoria, listen to me. Your life is in serious danger. 
I know Nathan is your friend, but he is truly unstable and dangerous. He did drug Kate at that party so he could take her someplace dark. What? Nice try, Max. But I don't believe you. And why would he do that? That I don't know yet. But it was enough to make Kate want to die. And I think you're next. Max, that is crazy. Nathan is like one of my best friends. Yes, he takes serious meds, but that's not his fault. His family treats him like a total freak just because he has little meltdowns. They're not little anymore. They're deadly. I, I don't care if you hate me or not, but you have to believe me. Please. You could have been a major bitch to me when I got hit with that paint, and I deserve it. It's so it. weird without the music, isn't it? Max, I don't hate you. I actually think you're one of the coolest people at Lockwood. Why is it getting so hypey? But cool. You just don't know it yet. Maybe I'm jealous because you don't give a shit what anybody thinks, and I do. To be honest, Nathan has been freaking me out lately. He's not here, and I haven't seen him. Just make sure you stay away from him. And stick close to your friends tonight, okay? I let you boss me around this one time. And I have other people I can go to for protection. Thanks for telling me this, Max. If what you said is true, then you be careful too. I've got my own protection. Um, text me if you need anything. I will. Thanks, Victoria. Au revoir. Okay, so that seemed to go kind of well. We've at least won Victoria, but we've not found Chloe. She's here. Up to mischief. Hobie Dino, 3X, says Chloe, would you ever play Subnautica on stream? Maybe there's hope yet for Victoria and me. Uh, we could do. I'm glad I warned her. Dana is here. I hope she's okay. Do, should, do I need to talk to everyone? I don't know. Real fuck. Yay, Max! I can't believe you showed up. Why didn't you tell me? I like her. We up together. <laughs> As you can tell by my outfit, I, I was in a hurry. Dana, have you seen Nathan around? Hell no, I've been dancing with Trevor. Come on and dance with us. <laughs> Look at Trevor trying to bust a move. Trevor or the end of the world. You guys look really happy together. I think we are. <laughs> He's so different than Logan. We actually talk about life. And he knows how to be safe. I hear you, Dana. But I want you to avoid Nathan if you see him, okay? I will if I want to have fun. I still feel sorry for him. He needs help, but not from his family. Sean Prescott. What do you know about his dad, Sean Prescott? Uh, rich. And rich. And a dickhead, according to Nathan. The Prescotts can't buy a happy family or a happy club. Sounds like you're ready for a change. I don't need any club to be cool or have friends. <laughs> Look at you. Plus, I like hanging with Trevor and his skater friends. No drama. That sounds like a plan, Dana. I'm glad Trevor is with you tonight. Thanks. <laughs> the boy cannot dance, though. Look at that. <laughs> Poor Trevor. I love that Trevor doesn't care how goofy he dances in the VIP <laughs> section. Okay, I'm not speaking to that slow person again, like him over there, he's just really mean. So I'm gonna chat with Chloe. Oh good, Chloe's here. Okay. She obviously didn't find Nathan. There you are. Danny D says Chloe, talks Nathan to everybody, it's worth it. I talked to Nobody Dana, so. Tonight. He's definitely not upstairs. Why is he here? Damn. Maybe he's hiding in his dorm. Then let's bail. Nathan can't hide anymore. So, you made it, Max. Oh, uh, hey, Mr. Jefferson. <laughs> are you both okay? Why is like he a party? A, a mission. Oh, uh, I was just looking for Nathan. Uh-huh. I didn't know you were pals with him. I haven't seen him since this afternoon. He, he seemed pretty upset. I think he's still quite upset over the, uh, the whole Kate situation. Yeah, that makes sense. It's so weird without Let's the music, talk later, isn't it? <laughs> I have to announce the winner of the contest. I do wish you would have entered. You have to build up that resume and portfolio, but... I know you will. Thanks. I hope so. Okay, excuse me. I'm almost on. Let's get the hell out of here, Max. This is such like a weird thing for like the teachers to be endorsing. Like, what? Okay, okay. Everybody, calm down. Thank you. Thank you. I, I appreciate it. I, look, I don't want to get in the way of the party, but it's time to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes contest. 
Before I do, I want to thank everybody who entered their photograph so and everybody who thought so about it. Now this is what? the most important step in being an artist. Sharing your work with the world. All of you represent Blackwell Academy and everything our school stands for. As far as I'm concerned, you're all everyday heroes. The envelope, please. And the winner is... Come on! <laughs> oh my, what a shocker. Victoria Chase. Wait, this is gonna separate her though, isn't it? From her friends. Thank you so much, Mr. Jefferson. It was your incredible photography that brought me to Blackwell, and I hope I can live up to your name and fame. I also want to thank all the students for being so dedicated in their pursuit. And I'd like to dedicate this prize to Kate Marsh. She is the real everyday hero of Blackwell, and I can't wait for you her to You were the back. one that bullied her the most. Thank you. You suck, Victoria. <laughs> Victoria won. Big surprise. I can't believe she blackmailed Jefferson. Yes, I can. Who fucking cares? Rachel is still dead, and I want Nathan's punk ass now. Me too. Let's go check out the dormitories. Okay, so the party was kind of a washout. Okay, Clemmy says don't trust Jefferson. Be careful from now on. I never trusted him anyway, honestly. Look at the state of the compass. Christ. Nathan just texted me. He says there won't be any evidence left after he's done. Glad you got one last look at Rachel. Shit. Idiots! We have to go to the junkyard right now. Why didn't they take pictures? You're a photographer. Why didn't you document all the evidence? Take a picture of that as well, you spoon. Seriously, what is wrong with them? That I want to shake them. They're, they're low-key kind of annoying me because they're not doing things with, ugh, with any kind of, like, sensibleness. No sensible heads here. Stop stomping around, Chloe. Right. Just get ready to use your rewind fast if Nathan tries to jump us. Oh, God. How did Nathan have a number? How does everyone text each other so easily in this town? Oh, my gosh. Are you kidding? It's going to make me control it in the dark? Oh, no. I can't remember where her body was. <gasps> I don't like the dark. I got chills straight away then. Oh, God. Where is she? Is she over there? Where's Stompy Feet? I'm going to stick with Stompy Feet. God, I want to fucking kill that little psycho. Hey, I can't focus if you're yelling. Please. <gasps> what was that? <laughs> I'm scared! So creepy out here. Am I gonna find something separate to her? Come on, come on. Nathan needs to die now. Are oh, we actually gonna kill God's him? God's sake, Chloe, you have to be quiet. Max, please, we hurry. could He's dug her out. He's dug her body out. I bet he didn't mean to kill her. Oh god, Max, look. She's still there. Don't look, Chloe. Jeez. <gasps> oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. We can't use our power. No! Chloe! Look out. What the fuck? Oh my gosh, no, 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 rewind! Oh my gosh. I didn't realize she had bullets on her necklace. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Oh, <gasps> is her in the head? Who was that, who was that? Why did he kill Chloe but only, only do the shot on us? The injection. <gasps> no freaking way. Oh my gosh. What? How did, did he follow us here? Did he kill Rachel? Did he kill Rachel? 
Oh my freaking gosh. What? Wow. Holy crap. Oh my gosh. Okay. Jeez. That was intense. Let's check our results. Only 50%, just over 50% of people accepted closed requests to die. You let Warren beat up Nathan. Most people stop. This is really close now. Like, really close. Chloe killed Frank. What? Chloe wounded Frank or no one got hurt? Chloe could kill Frank on that scene? Jeez. Victoria believed your warning. 10 people didn't even warn her. They were just like, bun her. You saved the blue jay. 60% of people let a blue jay die. What? You didn't disturb the bird's nest. You found David's code. You helped... Kate helped you find Nathan's room. You motivated Daniel to attend the club party. 73% of people didn't even do that. You left a, more, a mo message on Warren's slate. 78% of people didn't. You figured out his pin code. You helped Alyssa. Wow. Okay. I can't believe so many people let the... The Blue Jay die. Okay. Jeez, that is crazy. So, Mr. Jefferson... Mr. Jefferson, all along, was potentially the person that killed Rachel. And he's definitely the big body. He is 100% the big body. Actually, the real big body is Darcy because he switched off my PlayStation. <laughs> he literally switched off my PlayStation. And yeah, did you see me do that face? <laughs> he switched off the PlayStation and nearly made us lose everything. Simply Shelby 3, thank you so, so much for being here for two months. Love you, Claire. You're so amazing. Keep being you. So is Chloe like dead dead? I don't know. If we can't rewind time, I'm actually gonna scream. She got shot in the head. There's not really much coming back from that. But what is the deal with Mr. Jefferson? What is the deal with Mr. Jefferson? Super, super freaking weird. We're gonna be doing a raid. Um, we're gonna try and find someone that's kind of calm because that was a pretty intense stream. Uh, please remember your Korean. Tuayo, tuayo. The tuayo is I like you. Please, please, please remember that. And um, we will be finishing off this whole game. Finishing off the whole of this game next week. So hopefully you guys can tune in for that. If you're on YouTube, please, please, please give this video a cheeky little like. Um, please give it a little share and let me know in the comments below if you saw that Mr. Jefferson uh, twist coming. Because I didn't expect him to be that bad. I genuinely did not expect him to just shoot somebody directly in the head. Let me know if you guys thought that you... Um, if you expected that, I'm impressed. Um... But wow, wow, wow. I will see you guys next week. Thank you so, so, so much for watching. Bye bye.